Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari 2600 and 7800 games. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Friday. Mm -hmm. Welcome to you. Thank you. <laughs> Welcome to you. <laughs> Watching live or on YouTube, uh, we've got five games tonight. Excellent. Two new ones mm. and two old ones and a very old one that we're going to be challenging the patch on. Mm. Um, we're going to be playing the new version of Iran, the final version. Oh, cool. Okay. Of the 2600 version. Yes. Uh, we're going to be playing a new game called Cribbage Squares Solitaire. Okay. Um, I've never played Cribbage, so... I have a long time ago. I, <laughs> I, I, I that... As long as there's an explanation of how it's played, yeah. I'm sure and I'll it, be and fine. And it's <laughs> very, very simple. Yeah. Um, I, I, and I don't think it's like Cribbage Cribbage. It's like a playoff of Cribbage. Mm. But I don't know anything about Cribbage. Um, we're going to be playing UFO Reader. Redder, depending on how you say it. I don't know how to say his last name. It's like one of those things you read but never say out loud. All these people's names that make these games. I'm like, <laughs> I don't know. How am I supposed to know how to pronounce them? Mm -hmm. um, Encaved by Simon Aquarenhorst. And then we're going to be playing Pressure Cooker. Okay. Trying to get the patch. Okay. That. I remember last time it was really hard. Like really hard. And we didn't get very close. I, yeah. I did it was, not it's a tough well. game. I think I played fun. it once before. It is fun. Yeah. But you're, you're fine, fine, fine. Then it ramps up and it's like, bang. It just yeah. gets really hard. I, that's what I remember. And it's I like was, the... I would hit a point and that was it. Grandfather yeah. of all those food making food games. Food building games, yeah. Yeah, where you have mm -hmm. to, you know, first cut the food and then fry the food yeah. and then plate the food in a certain order. This is just plating the food and sending it on, on its way. Specifically burgers. Mm -hmm. um <clears throat> thank you to all the twitch subscribers out there that support the show on this list beside mm -hmm. us let's see if your name made it on here it, mm -hmm. be. it is yeah. alan the fur armscar coder <clears throat> cafe man 2d captain classic headlocks charles and check coconut 81 dianoid dan of ec glenn main great defender gretem's ground trooper ozier rapper 2600 johnny nitro Johnny WC23, Juan Urado, Carl G. Mark Space Inc., MCP90, Metal Atari 1969, Mick Muse, Mighty Squirrel, Mighty Squirrel, <laughs> uh, Miss Command, MK Smith, Mixter Fix, Muddy Funster, Nathan Strum, Pack Rat VG, Quahog 2600, RC70, Repentless VG, Ricardo Pim, Six Sweet, Smitty B7800, Socrates 0603, Spartan 581, Esmeris 2008, The D Train 37, The Welshman 89, Th Thrust 26, Thunkus, Tiki Dan K, Trek MD. Mm. And you can support the show as well for free by linking your Amazon Prime to your Twitch Prime and click subscribe. Free. Very little effort. <laughs> and make sure you follow us for all the latest updates. And thank you everybody for tuning in mm -hmm. tonight live on Twitch and, uh, you know, giving up your Friday night. Yes. A couple hours for us while yes. you're at home. Quarantined. Not going out. Spreading <laughs> viruses all over the place. That's right. Don't. You're do it you're doing or getting a, viruses you're doing a good job <laughs> that's right you're still with us stay here. with us watch the show if you're watching the show you're have a drink you're doing fine that's right grab a drink grab a cat mm. um surprise surprise james is playing all the aa released games from monday mm. well i'm gonna wait till i have them physically mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. that's much more fun opening the boxes and things like that because i have technically played all of them mm. or almost all of them them. Mm. I think there's one I haven't played, Panic Room, mm. um, because they have not posted it. I know there's been beta testers, but I'll, you know, I'll play that one when I have it physically in my hands. Mm. Oh, Scott Linux grabs a drink and pets cats. There, That's the way to go. do it. Don't drink the cats and grab the pet. <laughs> what? Drink the cat and pet the drinks. <laughs> grab, grab, grab the, the cats. The, you can grab, grab the cats. cats. I guess they might not like that. But yeah. in relation to the Atari Age releases, mm. um, now that the pre-orders have started, mm. which games did you buy or mm. want to buy? Mm. Um, there's going to be a lot of options on this one, so yeah, no hold kidding. on to your hats here. Yeah. <laughs> um, there's the poll. Mm. Yeah, big list. Oh my goodness. So all of them? Because <laughs> there's so good ones, so many good ones. So option one is all of them. Uh, number two, Avalanche. Number three, Cannonhead Clash. Number th four, Daredevil. Okay. Number five, Deep Stone Catacomb. Awesome one. Can't wait to play that again. Hugo Hunt. You can pick multiple, right? Uh, yeah. You okay. Can, oh, yes. You, you should can mention pick that before you start, before this runs up the yeah, screen. So. I think it's like 
one space, two space, you have or to put one spaces? comma. Okay. I don't know. Oh. They don't give very good instructions. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Vote by typing one, comma, two, comma, three. Yeah, there you go. So use commas. Commas. That's right in the instructions. Excellent. Here. Um, Hugo Hunt, number six. Number seven, Miss Galactopus. Um, that's the unlimited. He did release a limited version mm. of, I think, 10 or 20. One's up on my shelf. Mm -hmm. um, Ninjish Guy in Low Res World, number eight. Number nine, Panic Rooms. Number 10, Pit Cat. Number 11, Robot City. Number 12, The End. Number 13, Tower of Rubble. Number 14, Venture Reloaded. Number 15, Zookeeper in Alphabetical Order. <laughs> no specific. I'm getting more than one, but not all of them. Yeah. Well, type in the ones you're type getting. Type in the ones you want to get. You want to get, you are getting, because they are on pre-order. Or the ones, pre -order. Ma maybe if it's too many numbers, the ones you're most excited yeah. about. Pick pick your top three. Yeah. Do, do whatever you want. Do whatever <laughs> you, you can like. do whatever you want. Oh, there they go. <laughs> Some are coming in. So there. are they working? Uh, oh, my God. It's off the screen. Ooh. What is the uh, oh the results. results? Oh my god! Well, can you scroll it? Can you scroll it back and forth? Like start with scroll it? No, but I can make it bigger. You can make it smaller. Uh, make the window bigger. Oh, that just makes it. Oh no. Bigger. Oh um. Hmm. If you make it narrower and higher, no. That's. Oh, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know how to do it. <clears throat> I know how to do it. It's under, under properties. You say how big it is, and then mm. I can make it smaller. Let me do that so we can see the results coming in, making sure that everything is correct. So, 1,200. No, let's go with 1,000 first. Or it could disappear. Or it could move and at least show the top. <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. Now That's a little better. Make it smaller. You guys can't see it yet, but you will. Oh. You will in a second. Yeah. So I'm doing it on my side. Yeah. It'll just hide the Some subscribers for a bit. Some yeah. things take effect immediately. You guys saw the subscribers. Yeah, that's fine. Um, <laughs> is it working? I don't know. So many people have voted already. I don't know. It says two zookeepers, 15, 15, 15, 15. I don't think it is working. Oh, no, it might be slow to update, though. It may be slow to update. That looks about right. The numbers, there are numbers popping up. Yeah. Who voted? Let's see. Anybody pick 14 yet? They did, but it's not registering. One, two, three. Nope. Try spaces. Try spaces. Sorry, everyone. Like, is it just picking the first one? It Maybe. doesn't look like it. It Maybe. didn't add four. Yeah. It, it was, is there a 14? Uh, it's not counting a 14, and oh. somebody voted for 14. With a oh, space no. comma? Yeah, so do... I did... Set oh, it. oh, now it's jumping up. Well, the 10 jumped up. Yeah, number 14 is But the 11 didn't. Up. Yeah, That's there's lots weird. not jumping up. So, oh, people are doing spaces now. Good. Uh, 11, 13. It is jumping around. Oh, now it's working. Spaces it's working. are working. Okay. So do it all. Do all your choices again with spaces. It won't double count them. So It'll double count the first one, I think. No, it won't. Do if the same person votes, they can't go spam three, 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 three. Oh, really? Yeah, it'll just. Uh, it'll count only you register once. it once. Yeah. Oh well, so, that's smart at least. So do that. Now it's all yeah. working. Now we now we figured okay. it out. <laughs> Why would it give an example with commas when it doesn't work with commas? Terrible. Anyway, um, so we'll check back on that after a bit. Um, we have some mail right here. Um, it says. James and Tanya, I really enjoy watching your zero page homebrew videos. Awesome work. Because <laughs> it has a big exclamation mark and it's like awesome, awesome work. work. <laughs> uh, uh, happy holidays from Tim. Uh, oh, no, that's his address. <laughs> um, so we won't show that. Um, so this, uh, I know what this is. Mm -hmm. And I am going to actually show where I, actually I'll open it first and then I'll show. Oh, yeah. well, there might be that. something in there. Are you sure? Yeah. Seems okay. Always makes me nervous when Because there does. might be a letter or yeah. something or randomness. Oh, no, it's in here. It's wrapped in an ad. Classifieds. <laughs> Random class. Old classifieds. Replacement joystick. Issue 87, page 7. Nice. From. Oh, it's like a perforated. Ah, it could just be something printed, but yeah. It's got the Epix at 500 XJ. Excellent. An ad for it. Where is that? It's right here. It's got an ad for this joystick right here. Oh, that's funny. That's hilarious. That's awesome. 
Um, anyway, that's not what we're looking at. Um, it is the Bridge Patch, mm. which this is a homebrew patch, not a homebrew game, but a patch made well after, because this one oh. was not made during the original run of Activision yes. games. Um, so let me show you guys it. Nice. There you go. The bridge. Grandmaster. Grandmaster. And I'm guessing that's a good hand in bridge. <laughs> I don't know. The king, queen, ace three, and ace jack, and I'm sure it is. I do not know how to play bridge, so. Yeah. We're going to have to learn. I know it's a learn. complex game. I know it's a complex game. We're going to have to learn at some point mm. to be able to get the patch. Mm. Yeah, it's really nice. It's it actually a, sewn. Yeah, I like it when it's uh, embroidered. Yeah, and yeah. not just printed. Yeah, this one's Very a nice. really good one. You can tell on the back because you can see the the sew marks yeah yeah the yeah this one's a good one nice. and it was offered through a, i don't know where how i ran across it but mm. you can or oh there you go arena foot from the 2600 co connection arena foot's on it boom let's take a look um so uh 2600 connection so 2600connection.com bridge and embroidered patch now available do you remember back in the day when Activision offered embroidered patches? <laughs> if you got a certain high score, you could take a picture. Yeah, we all know that. Um, but now, 40 years later, a patch is now available for bridge. <laughs> you can be a bridge grandmaster. Mm. No distinguished gaming accomplishment required. So we have to make up one, which I think beat mm. the computer. Like, that's, that's the minimum. Mm -hmm. um, and since I have no idea how to play bridge, I think beating the computer is definitely an accomplishment mm. if you play. Mm -hmm. Um, heck, I have owned this video game cartridge for years in my collection. I still don't know how to play yeah. it. I suppose I should learn how to play the card game Bridge one of these days. And there you go. He's got the Bridge cartridge. Actually, a pretty good... It's not too much active plaque mm. on that. It's very clean. Looks very nice. Unless yeah. it's a replacement uh, And a nice label. original controller. Yeah, very clean original controller. And a cup. Uh, for, for, uh, you gotta scale. have your coffee. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> While you're playing bridge. Um, please note Activision bridge came cartridge, choice of controller and coffee cup are not included oh. with the purchase patch. Um, so it's, it's quite cheap. Uh, $7 oh, that's nice. and $1 shipping Yeah, and $2 shipping. If you live anywhere else. Nice. That's re really inexpensive. It's, shipping, it's so. really nice because it, yeah. it, it can go in letter mail for most places. Right. So yeah, that's quite cheap. Updated Friday, November 6th. So I think this is pretty new. Mm. Uh, this this patch probably why I ordered it because they listed it somewhere. I'm like I don't have that patch. Yeah, I'll and it's seven patch. bucks. It's nice. The, one of the cheapest patches you can get. Yeah. Um. So there you go. If you want that patch, there's how to find it. Mm -hmm. Um. Free TB12. I'm the Cribbage Squares Dev. Oh, nice. Oh, so nice. we're gonna be playing his game yeah. tonight. That's um. Uh, Hot Rod. Uh, is his name on the Atari mm. forum. So thank you for making that game. We're looking forward to playing it. Yeah. Um, hopefully we can figure it out. It look, The instructions look pretty straightforward. Mm. Um, so everybody knows the plus ROM, uh, the plus cart, sorry, um, mm. where you can play the games over the internet, download them. Um, I have it somewhere over here. Um, so a module has been released for the plus cart for Batari Basic, mm. so now you can include functionality in your games in Batari Basic easily um, by uh, just adding in what they've developed. Oh, so cool. you can have high scores automatically be registered on, on their high score page. On their high score page. Wow! So that's really cool. I think. Let me see if I have. Um, I don't think I have that up. But anyway, I'll just read it out. Um, Alan the First says, uh, Yesterday I modified Phil Sand's Batari Basic Game LEM Lunar Excursion Module. Oh, so he must have had the source code for that. Mm. To send the score online to the Plus Cart High Score Club. Mm. Therefore, I added experimental Plus ROM support to Batari Basic. Mm. Plus ROM functions are supported by Gopher 2600, Javatari, and the Plus Cart. Um, so that is in the Atari Age forums. Um, and then uh, you can add your Batari Basic made game and have it listed mm. on the high scores, which is really, really cool function. And um, and then you can have your game also downloadable on their list of games so that everything just works online. That's cool. Yeah. And then all you need is a plus card. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> to, to complete it. Um, 
And speaking of carts, awesome carts, uh, the Dragonfly cart is now on sale. It went on sale on Monday, which is seems like eons ago now, <laughs> so five days ago. Um, and I put my order in for one. Oh, that's getting bigger. So let's take a look at the website here. And this is a plus. This is a cart for the Atari 7800, and it looks really, really slick here. Um, so they've started a pre-order list nice. for them. Yep. Uh, they come in two colors. Ooh, very the, nice. I ordered the red one. Nice. Um, <laughs> What's the other color? Oh, a nice purple. <gasps> oh, why didn't you get the purple? Because I like the red. <laughs> <I love> the <laughs> it's purple. like such a deep, deep red color. I just, I just love it. The, I don't, pink. the purple just didn't. It's like purpley pink. Purple That's pink. so distinctive. Well, you can order one for yourself. Um, I'm not sure we need to, but... <laughs> so the pre-order nice. uh, list has started there. Um, there are currently mm. 101 people mm. on the pre-order list. You don't have wow. to pay yet. They'll email you when they get to your name. And then they will ask you, what options do you want? Oh, nice. And get your payment then. Nice. Um, so let's take a look at this technical specifications for this, because this is the second uh, 7800 SD based cartridge out in two weeks after like years, of years and years and years <laughs> and years of nothing to yeah. come out in this within two weeks. I think it was a week and a half. Um, so it supports uh, a lot of stuff. A78 files with header in lots of sizes, all the way from 4K up to a meg in size, which is massive, a massive wow. thing. Um, and it supports uh, Pokey, uh, dual Pokey, and also the Yamaha, a uh, Yamaha chip, which mm -hmm. is seldomly used, mostly used in demos, um, but it's also been used in a Pac-Man homebrew. Mm -hmm. So it's been in w at least one at homebrew least one game. Homebrew. Okay. Um, so it, it's very very useful for that. Mm -hmm. um, like I said, two colors. So the biggest question now, because there's two choices for your people to buy mm. and play games on their 7800 with an SD card, what are the differences? Which one do I buy? <laughs> because there are actual fairly sizable differences between the two. Yes. Basically, they both definitely play just about everything out there. That's, I mean, that's the Which, key, right? Yeah. That's what you care about. Is that's what you want. Yeah. Right? So if to you're play the games. Yeah. a user... You're just playing games. Mm. It's both are pretty much going to suffice for you, yeah. Quite quite nicely, but there are some differences. And uh, Sean in SH AWN in the Atari Age forum summed mm. it up um, better than I could. Dragonfly can do Yamaha and Dual Pokey. Mm. Those are the audio chips. Mm. Um, Concerto cannot. Concerto has one Pokey chip, mm. um, so it can do Pokey, but not two Pokies. So that just means more sounds. Mm. Um, Concerto has an, an on-screen menu, um, whereas the uh, Dragonfly... So silly. Sorry. You're moving your hand, and, and, and Atari is just like, <laughs> are you playing? Are you playing? <laughs> uh, I apologize. Okay. <laughs> I was distracting. I was uh, being very cute. So the, uh, the Concerto has an on-screen menu, yes, on like screen. the Harmony cart, like yes. we use, that yes. everybody's very used to. Yes. Um, and the dragonfly has it on a little screen, as you can see there. Has a little readout. Mm, yeah. And the menu buttons are beside it. Okay. Um, so you have to be beside your console to. So would you set it up and, and put it in, or put it in and then f and then scroll to it? Well, I guess you turn it on, like it. Well, technically, that's powered separately. So it needs to be plugged in. It. That's also another difference. It needs ah. to be plugged in along with your um 7800 both okay. have to be plugged they in both have to but be it kind in. of operates separately oh. um i'm not sure how or when it i think you can plug it in and then you select the game and then you press enter and then it's active but i'm not sure if you can operate without when we the get it we'll, we'll we'll figure it out right yeah it'll have instructions yeah um yeah it is very nice looking it is nice looking um so it does need to be powered Yes. Because it's got a screen, yes. mostly, I believe. There yeah. might be, it might need actually more power for the um, chips as well. Mm. I'm not sure what the power is completely for. Um, there's different bank switching methods are supported on each, but, um, but the ones that matter are supported on both. Like I said, most games work. Um, 
right now the dragonfly supports bigger games that most people don't make yet but now it goes up to a, at least a meg. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, but I was reading today that the concerto goes up to 144K, oh, yeah. but he's like, he hinted that it could be opened up be for expanded. more. Okay. So I'm not sure how big the memory is on the concerto cart. Mm. So there is a hard limit, of course, but mm. I'm not sure what it goes up to right now. Um, the Dragonfly is a pass-through pass power cable, which is like, because it needs power. So you mm -hmm. plug in the Dragonfly, and then there's a power out from the Dragonfly into your 7800. So they, it, they sell cables for that as well. Oh, I see. Yeah. So you only need one power cable, or you can power them both separately. Oh. There's options. Yeah, okay. Um, it says, the Dragonfly is literally what the XM expansion module wanted to be, except it takes SD cards instead of cartridges. So there was, was or is, I don't know much about the expansion module, but it was a thing you plugged into the 7800 and you plugged the cartridge into it. Okay. So it was like the thing you needed to buy once rather than having a chip in every cartridge. Mm, you know, okay. because Ball Blazer has a chip in it. Yeah. And Commando has a chip in it. Mm. Um, so instead of putting a chip in every cart, it would just be an expansion module. The chips are always there. And then the carts would cost less. Mm. Not powered from the cart. Oh, but the 7800 provides 5 volts. Okay. Um, concerto is the harmony cart for the 7800. Mm. So the concerto has a harmony encore cart built into it. So the thing I use all the time yes. in the 2600. It's basically in the 7800. It's in cart. that. Yeah. You can run 2600 games on the 7800. That's nice. Yeah. yeah. Normally you can do anyway. You can plug a 2600 cart into and it. Just... But the Dragonfly does not have that in it. Oh, you so you can't, can't you can't download it. the twenty six hundred games to the Dragonfly. No, it does not work. Uh, so that's a big, big difference. Yeah. So if you wanted to play twenty six hundred games off an SD card, you would have to have a Harmony card. Yeah. Plug into the seventy eight hundred. You'd have to switch it out. Mm -hmm. So that's you Another know there's difference. pluses and yeah. minuses for both. Yeah. Um, he says the Dragonfly is more expensive, but it isn't right now. Right now, the Concerto's on sale for eighty nine dollars. Okay. And I believe this is also, this is 95 right now. Okay. Bare bones, 95. Yeah. Um, you can get the Dragonfly uh, with a Pokey Max, which is dual Pokey for 43. Okay. That's an add-on. And you can get the Yamaha chip as well as an add-on for $27. Mm. Um, and then there's the cables, depending on how your cabling is. Mm. So t right now the Dragonfly is, more, is a little bit more expensive. Yeah. But once the sale is finished from the Concerto, the Concerto will be a little bit more expensive at okay. ninety nine. But yeah. they're they're within dollars. Pretty pretty close to. Very each other. comparable. Yeah. yeah. Um, oh, there, I'll leave it on that picture now. Um, uh, both are great. The Dragonfly has features that would be future proof um, in terms of. The Yamaha, if more developers start using the Yamaha mm. chip, that's not in the Concerto. Yeah. But if concert you add it, you have to add but it. But only up. one game is made with it right now. Yeah. So, mm, 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 mm. you don't know. Maybe you want it just to have it. Now, the big, big difference, the Dragonfly has a USB port. I don't think the Concerto does. So what that means is you can plug the Dragonfly into your computer and just send the game instantly you don't have to take the sd card out put oh, it in your computer load it up that's put really it back nice. in so so developers can go <sighs> new one really nice. try it new one try it yeah uh there is a new pokey out yes pokey one pokey something kev kelly asked mm. uh concerto was sold out and then it he releases every wednesday and sunday new batches so okay. far um, but now just today, I didn't get this news story in, but just today he is taking reserves, uh, for $10 because mm. he doesn't like, he did, he says he doesn't like making a reserve list, a pre-order list yeah. without taking money because people back out and he has to follow up and people yeah. don't pay and stuff. So he's yeah. taken, it's a lot so, of work, yeah. so now there is kind of a pre-order list for the concerto, but it's like you reserve with a little bit of money. Yeah. With $10, I believe. Mm. So, um, there you go. <laughs> yeah. Dragonfly is really good for developers, uh, in respect to the USB, 
but it's not too like depending on how you make your games if you're like trying something out and you want to try it on real hardware instantly rather than an emulator yeah. a usb is really handy it is handy yeah um the harmony encore has a usb you can see it right there yeah i can i don't know if people it's pretty tiny no, yeah you can't see it no. but the harmony encore has a usb but i'm pretty sure the concerto doesn't mm. i don't want to say yes or no but i'm pretty sure it doesn't um let's see and then s also muddy funster added to this um he says just add to what sean said a few homebrew support pokey not not too many but there are more and more he says and the list of them grows daily danger zone which is muddy funster's making that's the, hmm. the flying mm -hmm. one that we played for that's really fun pretty good, supports yeah. pokey as well as exo hmm. which is the cavern flying one i don't think you've played it no and a lot of other devs are supporting pokey for new titles and demos of new games pop up all the time i think only pac-man xm supports the yamaha and a few demos mm. right now the concerto doesn't support roms bigger than 144 ah but can theoretically do 256 plus 16 kilobytes of ram and 512 without ram so 99 percent of homebrews are covered mm. dragonfly supports up to 1024 kilobytes of roms with ram has a developer mode allowing roms to be pushed to the, from the cart to the pc on the fly for testing without needing to unplug it from the console or swap the sd card mm. So yes, the Concerto card doesn't have the direct connection, but the Dragonfly does. Um, as many people have said, both are fantastic pieces of kit. So there's the quick rundown of the two cartridges. Obviously, if you're a developer, you want to know a lot more about it. And if you're a 7800 developer, you probably already know all of Oh yeah, <laughs> true. You probably already have one on order um, for both of them. But I have picked up both mm. of them, or you can see my name. I don't have it yet. I haven't paid yet because uh, I am number 54 nice. right there. So it's getting down there. You know, he's got up to 12. <laughs> Oak City Comics hasn't paid or Tyrone Xavier hasn't paid yet. <laughs> Synth the Palooza Sorry. hasn't paid yet either. He's a musician. Uh, oh. <laughs> makes music for a lot of uh, 7800 games. Um, so there's a lot of people on the list already. Mm. So it's very proven to be very popular, mm. obviously um next on the uh list of news is that we got wait for everything to go away mm. i think that's fine to show <laughs> jerry sent in pictures <gasps> of his kitty <gasps> Uh, and he says, here's pictures of Daisy. Aww. First three were sent to me from foster parents Aww. when she was one and two weeks old. Oh, so cute. The last one is her with now with me. Yeah. At the Looks bottom. like Atari. You said Atari, but it's actually a Pixel. Pixel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so I thought you guys would Aww. enjoy seeing what uh, Pixel might have looked like at one week old. Oh, <laughs> so cute. Aww. So they both got the white stripe up the, between the yes. eyes. The white paws and the Should white. Should I go grab him? The white rough there. Look at that. Look at that rough. That really looks oh, like, like it Pixel. Does. Okay, so it. Tanya's going to go grab I'm Pixel. Cat. It's like, that's a cute, cute cat. So I posted some pictures of Pixel as a kitten. You can see there how similar they are. I mean, as. as somebody who's with pixel all the time you can see differences there's there's him he's only weeks old look how tiny and fluffy he is so cute and there he is in the sink being all proud of himself he doesn't sit in the sink anymore but so so very adorable um and tanya's trying to hunt down pixel i think he's in the bedroom um and that's shoki 1968 Oh, is he biting you? Oh, he's not happy. He's not a cute kitten anymore. He's, he's angry. He's an angry adult cat. I, oh. And the reason he's named Pixel is this Hi. black dot right there. Because yeah. he has a burnt out Pixel. Yeah. Right, right on his, his tongue. Belly. Oh, it's so soft. Oh, my goodness. Oh. <laughs> he's going to kill me. <laughs> but Aww. you can see how, how close he is. Yeah. In, in, uh, oh, did looks. you sell pic pictures yeah, of Pixel? Oh, it's so cute. So you can see the... Yeah. How close he is. Yeah. Oh. You, you showed the one of him in the sink. Yeah, the sink one is yeah. just adorable. Yeah. Right. It's my favorite. 
Yeah, he's so happy. Look yeah. at his, those happy cat eyes. Yeah, that was soon, fairly soon after we got him. Yeah, when he was tiny and fat r- fit in the sink. Yeah. Oh, so oh. adorable. Okay, I'm going to let You're this free. mad cat go now. So let's see. <laughs> uh, looks like lots of people have voted. Oh, yeah, look 2%, at that. 2% all, all the carts. Do, it doesn't sort them by uh, no, it percent? No, uh, <sighs> Zookeeper, not not unexpected. I I was gonna say zookeeper must be must 16. be up near the top. Tau rubble, very uh, oh, popular. Yeah. And Robot City, like uh, Nin- those are all very amazing. Yeah, games. Ninja Sky is also pretty high up there yep. too. Yeah, Ninja Sky uh, yeah. as well. Yeah, very nice. Yeah, so I thought it'd be fun to see what uh, what people are looking yeah. for in the games. Yeah, 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 yeah. So speaking of uh, uh, VHZC and Ninja Sky, mm. uh, the first game we're gonna be playing is I Ran. This is the mm. 2020 updated final release of the game nice. uh this is like an endless runner you can use the wireless joystick Excellent. or you can have the wired version <laughs> the wired version tends to work better usually ready um so let's take a look at any changes he's made because he posted it saying um final version that's all he said he didn't say what has changed no that's not mm-hmm. today it's the 11th down, 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 11th. There you go. Oh, one second. I have not changed. Mm-hmm. Don't say what's on the screen, please. I have to change things out. Oh, yes. Yeah, don't say that. <laughs> don't say that. No, I won't say it. <laughs> We've been beta testing a whole bunch of games. Secret games. Special games. <laughs> We can't talk about because can't talk about Fight Club. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so there you go. Yeah. I ran. This was first posted August fifth. Loaded up. Uh, two thousand nineteen. This build is from December first, twenty twenty. A VHZC mm. game. Du, 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 du. I ran. Mm-hmm. Game screen, please. We haven't started it yet. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry. Yeah. We're not playing yet. I was getting rid of something yeah. that nobody's allowed to see. <laughs> something very sneaky. <laughs> so, I ran 2020. I love VHZC's fonts. Yes. He uses this outline he does font. Great. He does a great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It, mm-hmm. in, and, it's, and it still fits. Like, the font still fits, even though that's a quite a chunky, big font mm. to do another layer outside of the normal um, size of the font. But he's able to um, uh, fit it all in. Mm. So... Go ahead. Ooh, normal or hard? We're gonna go with normal. Yeah. So, oh, you hit the first thing. <laughs> I was. I thought it was up. I couldn't remember uh-huh. if it was up or jump. There we go. Oh, up or jump. Yeah. There's. I think just jump and duck. Ooh. Yeah. And duck. <laughs> um. So this is a 16K F6 game. Uh, as per usual, beautiful, beautiful graphics. Yeah. Uh, thank you, Starman27, for following zero page. Um, I'm glad you're enjoying it. Mm-hmm. Um, other games he's made, Roach in Space, Roach in Space 2, Cosmic Boogaloo, uh, Bugaloo, sorry, 7800, Canonica, oh. Doremi, Draco, Iran for 2600 8-bit. We're seeing the 2600 version. Night Guy in Low-Res World, Castle Days for 2600 and 7800, Low-Res Car, Low-Res Racer, Ninja Guy, Peril, and he's also working on a board game that he's Ooh. been posting. I think I've shown you some screenshots. Maybe, ah, too soon. Yeah, uh, he's been posting screenshots of his board game, uh. which is like, I think it's based on n- ninja guy board game. <laughs> oh, or nice. Night Guy, it's, it's kind of like Night an guy? RPG board game hmm. um, where you kind of roll a, or you flip a coin, or you flip something, something's flipping over. Yeah. And you move the number of spaces it shows. And mm. then when you land on it, it's like either a fight or you get gold or nothing happens or like a variety or you get a mini game as well. So he's been working on mini games and that's been he's been posting it in the Atari Age Discord. Chat. Oh, OK. So if you're in the Discord chat, you can uh, check that out. Clearly inspired by Bit Trip Runner. Definitely appropriate since the team of the original uh since the uh, sentence doesn't make any sense uh, definitely appropriate since the team of the original game and he said without team <laughs> which would mean appropriate since the of the original game 
<laughs> James. I don't know. I don't know what you're saying. VH said C published a demo today. Oh, he did? <gasps> VH said C. Yeah. I checked it in the morning. He must have done it in the afternoon. Oh, my gosh. Oh, VH said C. Publishing things on a Friday, hours before the show. <laughs> I gotta check this out. Maybe we can include it as a bonus. Oh. Uh, let's see where it is. I would guess it would be under home discussion. Jump, jump, hello, jump. No. It's under programming. Nope. I'm just going to have to look under VHZC's name. Night Guy on board. 30 squares of fate. Work in progress. Oh, yeah, it's a 7800 game. Right. Yeah, we're going to have to look at this. Uh, oh. at the end of or maybe next we can look at it next just throw it in there thank you very much uh flackets for uh, uh letting me know two hours ago no wonder i didn't see it mm. i was getting ready for the show because i usually check i mean i i usually have the games ready um oh, I, every at time at least a day before Pushes you back all the way to the start. I there know. are checkpoints. I just haven't hit it. I haven't hit, gotten past the first, yeah. first checkpoint yet. The checkpoints ah. are little flags. Yes. They yeah. raise up, and you have to. They look like little push pins, actually. Yes. And you can't land on them. You do have to jump. You over do them. have to jump them. Yeah. I always think that's the checkpoint. Bees, duck. Oh, it's duck, duck for the ducks. Or the geese. My okay. turn. No, no, no. I need another. Um. I need another round. <laughs> Just I'm doing terribly. Usually I can get to at least the first checkpoint. So I don't know if he's actually added anything in or uh. if... The he's just finessed. New, but no, I can't we've remember. seen the flowers before. Yeah, the big flowers, the big red he flowers. He may have just done bug testing, or he may have just went, everything's good. Nobody's complained about anything. It all works. Um, so he posted uh, this latest version without any uh, notes, except for the word final version. Nice. Um, we might be able to tell from playing it, but nothing so far, but we haven't made it very far yet. I haven't gotten very far at all. Um, he does have a very nice t-shirt, an Iran t-shirt. Uh, nice. For sale on his T Public, which we, which we can take a look after, at after this. And duck for the ducks. There you go. There, there's oh, finally. the checkpoint. Oof, close. Oh, oh too close. <laughs> well, you got still got two two lives left. Is that at the checkpoint? Yeah. yeah. Great giraffe. Piggies. Ah! Surprise piggies! <laughs> it's actually quite tense when you start getting into it. Oh, oh too, too late. Too late. Okay, now you can play. I needed to get to that checkpoint. Yes. 335 points. <sighs> no, I don't was, know if that's, that's based on jumping or just sheer distance. Oops. No, oh, no, we can jump over that too. Little slime things. Jumpy slimes. It could be frogs. They're kind of slimy. Yeah. Oh yeah, I, it, it gets you every time. Because it's right in the middle. Yeah. Carl G, the giraffe with the trampoline is my favorite. I oh, yes. love the giraffe. It's, it's so super good. cute. What am I doing? Reset. <laughs> it pretty much rage resets for you. <laughs> it does. So you don't really need right to do Right back at the anything. beginning. <laughs> Unless you want all your lives. Yeah. Then it's like... Mm. Pretty yeah. easy to die though, so it is. You can just destroy yourself. Oh my and god! Jump. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Rage research. Yeah. I'm actually wearing a VHZC T-shirt. Ah, oh, very nice. Uh, Bosconian, because it's modeled after the arcade, not the 2600 Homebrew. Mm. Jump, duck. Jump. Mm -hmm. I find these really big to jump over for some reason. Some things are quite quite large. Yeah. Oh, you, you have to be so close with that. Uh, this is a game where you kind of learn it. Yeah, as you go. You memorize it. Jump. Yeah, because you have to know 
how things work. Yeah. Especially the pig. Like those are that's a surprising thing that comes back at you. Mm -hmm. And you have to be very fast with uh, the springboards. That one's pretty Ah, you think you have to duck that. I think you do. One more. So far, it's exactly the same. Yeah, it doesn't seem too different. But, but you know, at a certain point when you're programming, it's like, well, the bugs are gone. But <laughs> it's just that he's known for changing his graphics. Little like, graphics all the time, yeah. All yeah. the time. So every every uh new build is like oh my god there's totally new graphics right mm -hmm. <laughs> ah. i don't know if there's an end to this game or if it loops i mean when we were playing it it did but he yeah. might have a whole bunch of levels now so yeah but it's an endless runner kind of game so it might be endless it might speed just speed up after you um loop it and it's not easy because unlike other endless runners this one has such a huge variety of things yeah you never know what's coming <laughs> but it well in the easy mode you do in the hard mode, you don't. It is actually random. So we should go to the hard mode after. Oh, after. Because it'll it'll cycle through all, all of the things. Say what each unique hospital I'm not sure of. Okay. Um, that's a little elf. <laughs> <laughs> that's a mailbox or a sign. That's <laughs> a very large Super Mario type it's bullet. A, it's a bullet bill. It? Bullet bill. That's a piece of grass. That's some sort of snake. That's a purple bat. That's a mushroom. That's suspended hangy grass. Those are slime Slimies. frogs. <laughs> Said that. Said that. Oh, why? Why? It's the little gap. It gets you every time. Oh, this is in the way. I suppose right. he starts simple to concentrate on the core game, but then he gets all crazy to update the visual. Yeah, usually his core games, when he releases something, I've never found very many bugs. Like, they're very solid, um, that was close. Um, the games are very solid. Duck. <laughs> and it, and then he does change the graphics and adds levels. That's what he, I mean, this, I guess levels would be like obstacles in this game. So he, um, that's what his normal mode of operations is. Duck. Mm. Yeah, it's definitely duck. Hey everyone, what's your favorite adventure version? <laughs> adventure is not my favorite game, so I don't have a favorite version. Because there's always a level where it's a maze and it's dark. And that's my most James's nemesis hated. dark mazes. <laughs> dark mazes. It just mazes are bad enough, but then they throw you in the dark. And then you're like, because uh, I'm terrible at memorization. So maze is bad. I have to, um, no. Oh, did you <laughs> just kick the cat? I, I, not, I pushed him aside because <laughs> he was, he was looking. He was like ready to jump up on the Atari. Like he does to his brother. <laughs> it's true. Yay. Oh my God. I feel like those are new. No, I've, they've been in there really? before. Really? Yep. Oh. That's a bush. And that's a second checkpoint. Check that's three lives. Uh, duck? No. no. I bet it's jump duck for that. Mm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Those are not new. I've seen those before, too. Just not very many. Just not very often. Ooh, impaled. Uh, <laughs> those ones are high. So I'm going to have to be very, very... Yeah, you, sometimes you have to be really up close. Uh, oh, that's a guy hanging from a balloon. Those are torches. And it's game over. That sounds like trouble. That's a cat. <laughs> okay, let's do the hard mode. All maps okay. are dark, only eliminated by your small candle. <laughs> Cave light adventure. That sounds like the worst version for me. <laughs> Terrible at memorization, but playing a game relies on learning the pattern. Yeah. Okay, so go to hard. Hi, you sound like trouble. Come here. Of course he is. Come here. Come on. 
That's grass. Come on. Yeah, these are random. Those are barriers of some sort. Hi. Oh, you're cold. You're cold cat. Why are you cold? Where have you been? <laughs> oh, you got oh, one, you get you one, get one life. life. One shot. It's just as far as you can go on the one life, oh, I guess. Oh, that's kind of good. Yeah. Because it's not repeating. It's like, well, randoms, randoms, random. It's always just going to be random. Oh, oh see, that's hard. Weird. You almost have to, you always have to anticipate I guess those. you should avoid penult then. Yeah. No, there's no dark areas. Oh. Is there dark areas? No. No dark it's areas. It's dark when you first go in. You need the spell, right? Yeah. So, yeah. It's not so bad. No, no. There's no dark areas yet. Check the fridge. Earthworm Jim had a dark stage that was actually done well. Yeah, I... Oh, I can no, see ways of doing it well. There are dark mazes in penults? So <laughs> it better not says. be. Uh, I, I, I didn't find a penult bad for that because you get no. a spell. So eventually, yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's I lots suppose, of mazes. I suppose there... I know that's the worst, that one. The middle one. Middle bullet. The middle bullet makes you think you, you can go under it. But um, ma I ma we'll, map it. we'll be mapping them, right? So mm. I don't mind that. Yeah, I was just referring to the dungeons and needing light. Yeah, oh, if you don't have light, then you're, you're yeah, screwed. yeah. Well, you're not. I mean, you could wander around, but it would yes, be pretty you hard. You really um, have to memorize things if yeah. you're doing that. Mushroom. That was a bouncing bubble. Yeah, you have to duck for those. Yes, they're consistently. It's a matter you have to duck of duck for the ducks or the geese. I think he called them geese. He corrected me yeah. when, when he was on the stream once. It's like the geese. You should have made them ducks. I love the, the pig. pig. Oh, the pig is the so The pig is cute. great. The giraffe, great. Oh. It's good practice, though, the hard mode. Well, because you have to train your brain to just, oh, this React. is this. This is duck. This is, yeah. you know. So. Rather than memorizing, yeah. it's reacting. It's reacting, and you have to react at the right time. Especially the platforms I find challenging, because you have to hit them at the right point. You have to yes. jump, like, really quickly. Ugh. Yeah. Okay. You do one more round. All right. And then... We used to turn the darkness down on our TV to make our games more difficult when we were little. Oh my god. <laughs> Laughs in Doom 3's scientist escort section. I've heard Doom 3's really good. But I've got a million games to play. So. Oh, just, that was just made it. Very close. Oh, Ooh, that's. That. I've not seen that. That might be new. Those bricks. We never encountered them, but we never made it to the end before, so. Oh, that was close Ooh. too. But this is <gasps> <laughs> amazingly well done game. That was pretty good. The 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 city in the background with the parallax scrolling is really good. I, I think the key to this game is doing it on hard and seeing just how yes. how high a score you get. Yep, and just, then trying to loop the easy and trying to... I, yeah. I bet it loops. Bet Probably, it loops. but the heart is nice because you you could put this on a leaderboard and you just keep going until you die, you know? Yeah. Like, yeah, it's yeah. very cool. It's great. I like it. Mostly multiplayer first-person shooters. Is there an end? Well, we don't know. Not for the heart. The heart Not is the just heart. is random. Yeah. The easy might have an end. I don't know. I bet, yeah. yeah. Uh, Kev or Kelly says, I love the city scrolling. Yeah, yeah it's it looks really, really good. good. Okay, we're going to play a game on the fly here and just load up. We're going to use the uh, browser emulation because that's the easiest to get going. Okay. Um, so hopefully... Um, who said... Oh, Muddy Funster. Oh, stink. Muddy Funster said the browser is really good at everything except for the sound. Mm. So if the sound is screwed up, then... It's the browser. It's the browser? Yeah. So we're going to get our joystick plugged in. Oh my goodness, everything went dark for a second. That's not good. And switch it over and load up VHZC's brand new, brand spanking new game. Night Guy on Board, which I was just talking about, which is uh, so funny. Uh, so let me get that. Oops, stop it. Let me get that loaded up here. This is only two hours old. That's how fresh you get to see games on 
zero page homebrew. Okay, I've got it loaded up, I've gone full screen, which is probably going to freak out as soon as I switch to it. Uh, let's see. That's pretty good. That looks pretty good. There we go. Boom. Oh, you're leaving? I'm going to come back. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. So, here we are. This is Night Guy on Board. It says, Hi guys, I wanted to share the first demo work in progress beta of my new game. Night Guy on Board, 30 Squares of Fate. Uh, it's a one-player board game with some RPG elements. Oh, it's only one player. Interesting. Uh, the objective is increase the level and money of the character and get items needed to fight the final boss. The final boss is not programmed yet. Current beta includes mini games, battles, NPCs, chance tiles, treasures, teleporters, and the shop. I don't have a concerto or similar cart, so it has been only tested on a 7800 emulator, so I expect some bugs. So we'll find all the bugs. So I'll wait till Tanya gets back here. Yeah, I've been watching the development of this. Uh, he's been posting it in the Atari Age. Um, chat discord chat and he's been posting screenshots and videos of sit oh don't run away again <laughs> dealing with cat issues <laughs> cat issues um yeah so let's uh let's take a look do you want to jump into it yeah so monopoly style game it looks like yep work in progress beta one press button oh it's rolling it Skull Key is only available to warriors at level 7 or superior. Oh. So I get nothing? You get nothing! No soup for you. Is it your turn? or it's No, it's a one-player game. One, two, 14 Yay! gold coins. All right. That's way too loud. Sorry, everyone. Okay, that should be better now. Oh, Cats are going crazy. They're going nuts. Oh, no. Oh, an enemy. So the enemy has five hit points. You have 15. That's good. So you have attack, potion, or run. Don't run. Uh, attack. Oh, looks like... Oh, you actually... Oh, there's a bit of jump there. Four, and you 14. Oh, oh my so he goodness. Hit you That's terrible. Yeah, so you hit him for one, and he hit you for one. So it's even. It's fine. That's cool that there's skill involved. Just... Oh, I see. With the... Um... What he could do is make that faster or slower depending on the enemy it only goes down by one each time though oh probably because i'm you have a, a terrible weapon yeah but i have I 15 see. so that's fine you can't see Keep it over here. my wine glass is in the way seems to be akin to mario party party yes it does nice um but cooler since it's rpg theme <gasps> A vamp, a vamp witch, witch attacks damage five. Oh no she damaged you for five is it like Damage and run away? Yeah. Oh, it is. Oh boy, you're not doing well. Oh. Try the other button. What's the other button? That one. No? Nothing. Just single button. Okay. It's a pretty simple game. <laughs> okay, you're at the shop. Ah, recover 2 HP each turn for Ooh, $200. That's pretty good. I do good. not have $200. Oh, you don't. What else? Oh. Rochi. Oh, Rochi shield. A shield. Hit point plus uh, five. Wait, go back. Three hundred dollars. I do not have three hundred dollars. I know. I hadn't even finished reading it out the hit, po <laughs> the hit points yet. Okay. Yeah. Uh, bargainy. <laughs> Flea fee three. One hundred and fifty. I don't know what that means. Oh, I bet it damages you for three if you run. Oh, I see. Yeah. So it's hits you on less. the way out. Yeah. Yeah. Skull key. It's a key. Not it's available. Key. <laughs> Exit. So I get nothing. You but get, that's okay. Yeah. Now I know what they have. Yeah. Oh, I like this. Yeah, it's awesome so far. It's pretty fun. You now, if you have two players, even better. But solve the puzzle in forty moves. Yeah. Uh, oh. So. It's a potion. No, no, no. Uh, how do I move it? Up, down, left. Uh, right. Okay. Oh. I like this. I know somebody was suggesting that you don't need these arrows. You just move down, left, right, because there is only one thing to do at any given time. Yeah. Right. If you press down, that one piece will go down. Yeah, I think he's overcomplicating. Oh, it has the borders, oh, too. I didn't mean to do that. 
RPG needs more interactive elements like Super Mario RPG and Legend of Dragoon. Well, it's got little puzzles. Um, I know he's got some action um, parts to it. Mm, yeah, mm. you want that up and around that that corner piece, or are you trying to get the full top row? Oh, the middle. Oh, there's the middle. Oh, you're. I haven't played these in a long time. Um, I used to play them all the time. Ooh. I know me too. <laughs> Little nine by uh, three by threes and four by four. Uh, where do I want this? It's uh, RPG themed, not an RPG itself. Well, isn't it? It is an RPG. It's got health. It's got potions. You're fighting enemies. You have to get you have to get a key. You have to fight a boss at the end. It just happens to be played on a board with uh, dice. And RPGs are well, not RPGs, but yeah, role playing games played with dice too. Where's your top piece? Oh, it's on this first row, second column. So you need to get I that. I do these all the time, but I'm like. Yeah, those are totally backwards. <laughs> Your top row pieces. No, that's fine. The comment was regarding the skeleton fight. Oh, you appear to need have to have the attack box over the enemy to hit, where normal RPGs are just select fight. Oh, okay. So it's like an action RPG then. How about that? Oh, making things worse for myself. <laughs> well only 16 moves left so the pain won't last much longer we've got a long time one piece and two pieces three pieces in place yeah, it four matter. pieces in, i know it doesn't matter because <laughs> they're going to go out of place immediately you kind of you have to get a rotation i know order, i know and I then know. you get the next rotation order and then the next rotation uh, order action rpgs better than japanese rpgs whatever you call it it looks super cool yeah Nine. We've got the bottom left corner, which is good. No, that's not what I want. What do I want? <laughs> you have to get... I'm not I'm telling them. <laughs> I know you know. You have to get things in order of the rotation. I know. You have to put them in... I know I you know. know. Um, and then once you have them in the rotation of order, then you move on to the next corner, and then you get those in the rotation of order. VHZC has made an appearance! Too hey, VHZC! That's okay. Fail. I can do those, but it's been a while. <laughs> One. Skull key is only available to warriors! Yeah, yeah we know. Boo. We know. One. Oh, no! Oh, works. Potion time. I don't think I have one. We are checking it out. Oh, we had a potion. Good. Did not know we had one. Uh, now death. we're going to attack. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> there there we, go. we go. You have to be pretty much dead. There's on. a screen blip there. Mm. VHC. <laughs> <laughs> it might be on purpose because it kind of could be intentional. Yay, victorious. Yay, gold. Not much gold. 20. Did somebody steal our gold? Mm -mm. Oh my god. That's all we've got. We'll so never far. be able to buy those things in the store. Are there two stores? So we're at level zero. Hit points eight. It, oh god. Raining it's knives. Raining knives. <laughs> it's not a good rain. We're down to three hit points. Yeah, do you have any uh, potions? I can't do anything with Oh no, here. you have no potions. Oh I have yeah, it says there. Yeah. Skull key again. Uh where are we on the board? There we are. Two. Oh my god. Oh boy. <laughs> That's like Circus Charlie. Oh, that's so cute. That's, I want to do it again. No, I wasn't ready. That was so cute. That was so cute. Oh, four. Oh, God. Oh, no. Another potion? No. Nope. Oh, at least doesn't take my turn up. That's I think good. you're dead because I think you lose. You, he loses one, then you lose one. Hate those knife hurricanes. Yeah, it's terrible <laughs> weather. I wouldn't go outside yeah. when it's raining knives. I'd stay inside. Got it. Got him. But he, you only have even. one. You're dead. You're dead. Yeah. Oh, it's dollars. Oh, that's okay. I'm running. I'm going to die. Unless you get something Bonus. in a... Bonus. Warp, trap, advanced four spaces. Oh. Did I get anything for going over the 
in. Your like, HP's at back up to 15. Oh, nice. Okay, so if you make it around the board, That's your hit, hit points go Excellent. back up. Nice. Attack Excellent. is one. So there's the attack. That's yeah. why we're only hitting for you one. Need, you need... Interesting. The sword is... Oh, fight, I guess. Okay, here's a minigame. Oh, destroy? Okay, now I'm dead. Oh, I survived. I recovered. Twenty bombs? Oh ah! my god! I'm out of ammo. Oh, I got gold. Uh, did I miss anything? I didn't miss anything. No, it Maybe started just... speeding up though. But I couldn't shoot after that. Oh really? Up. Yeah. But I got oh. some gold. I'm happy. Cool. I'm happy. It's just a flesh room. <laughs> I've got lots now. You get that skeleton. Uh, VHZC, I, I made a comment that you could make the thing go back and forth faster, depending on the enemy, mm -hmm. or slower, depending how hard the enemy is. But he may have already thought of that. What happened? Nothing. Oh. You got gold. Oh, okay. Uh, VHZC, there are only five NPCs programmed for now, so you'll get the skull key text a lot. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, okay. A thief. Hi, Stole a coin. Great, great graphics. Yeah. Love the graphics on VHC's game. Yeah. Uh, and we played your uh, final version of uh, 2600 I there ran. There you go. You'll do better at this than I. It's been a while since I've done okay, this. Okay, so that is the bottom left. That is. Where's the middle? You probably have to just turn bottom. it all in a circle. That's always the approach I've always I've taken with those games. You just go. So you have to do. You have to kind of hold the piece. You oh. you know what? The best thing to do is put the middle in the middle and circle the outside and mm. until you get most of them in place sometimes, but it just depends. Um, the middle one is in the top right right, right now. There is no bottom right. That's the missing piece. Is the yeah, bottom right? The bottom okay. Right. So I need the that left one over. A bit. Um. But not yet. Yeah, this uh, control scheme is a bit funky. It's not bad, but it's it will do double funny. if you hold it. I, I, or it'll do a couple at once. Sometimes it'll slide them both. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Oh, I don't want that. I want to put this in the rotation here. Rotate that. You've only got five moves left, so. It's, this is. It's, it's challenging. Really hard. It's not impossible, but it's challenging. <laughs> yeah. It starts at the same place every time, so. Oh, okay. Yeah. One. As your level increases, new monsters will appear. Mm -hmm. So, just advice guy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> They're all advice NPCs. One, two, three. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, we just talked to you. He has no memory of us. It's the broccoli tree. Oh, it's... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Attack. Does he always hit you? Yeah, it looks like it. Oh. But, it but you don't have any armor. I bet if you have armor, you dodge him. Oh, or yeah. You prevent his attack, maybe? Yeah. Experience. No gold. The tree holds no gold. <laughs> the broccoli is no gold in the no broccoli. No gold in the broccoli. <laughs> Does feel like it needs multiplayer. That way, you're competing with rad with some rather than player versus environment. Yeah. Uh, I want that pony one, please. Yes, yes. So there's no left and right. It's just jumping. Just jumping. No it's like oh, I there's ran. a ducking. There is a ducking. Oh, is there ducking? Yep, tiny little duck. Okay. Tiny, tiny. 
I don't know if it comes into play yet. Mm. Yeah. So every blank space is advice NPC. Yep. Oh, that's an advice. I thought they were giving me the key. No. It's just advice. They're NPCs. One, two, three. Uh-huh. So my hit point should go back up after I go past the inn. Nice. I'm up to 16 now. Oh, I see. <laughs> see, that's the way you can play multiplayer. You trade yeah. off. So there's a couple mini games. Yes. There's a store. There's fights against at least and three characters. And question mark ones, too. Play. Cost $7? Oh, definitely play. Oh. What? Oh, you have to pick whether rock, paper, scissors? Rock. Always rock. <laughs> oh, you're level one now. Oh, that's why we went up. Oh. oh. Cheater. Cheating computer. It, see, because it knows what we're picking. I just took seven of my gold. Well, you play the game. Yeah, <laughs> you win some, you, you lose some. You win some, you lose some. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, level one now. That's why we went up a hit point. Thieves. Oh, stop taking my monies. We'll never be able to buy those things in the store. We're at 21 gold. Oh, my God. Brutal. Oh, that's a lot. Brutal. Oh, what is this? Okay, careful. Oh, it's, it's, uh, don't, don't lose it. What am I doing? You're playing Pong. Am I? Yeah. You have to hit it. There you go. Get it. Because VHC said ah! he's, he's going to try and incorporate this game into all of his games. <laughs> it it uh, moves slowly, so. Just track it. Just move with it. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> it's probably hard and I'm just giving you a hard time. There you go. It's only got seven hit points left. Six, five. Oh, no, I can't move fast. You've enough. got three balls. That's why you have to track it. No, or no, I can't middle. move fast enough. I'm, I'm not joking. I can't catch there. up to you it. Move the exact same speed. I know, and that's problematic. Is all I'm saying uh, is, is it's, uh, it. I think you still got it. Uh, that's why you need all those hearts. That's why you need all the hearts. Yeah, it, it doesn't quite move faster than it. So. This breakout is hard. <laughs> the ball moves at the, the same, same speed. speed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you do get a lot of lives, so that's good. Yes. You want to get it up and behind so then it hits it So it's kind of times. fair, because you still sort of, yeah. left with two lives, and that's the first time you ever played that. Yeah. Oh. Level two? Oh. Why is my HP at two? Oh, because we're, we've been hit a lot. Use potion next time you fight. I don't have any potions. Maybe the button can be used to accelerate the paddle. Uh, run. Run. Potion. No, 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 no. Back, back, back. I don't have back. potions. Oh, right. Never mind. No potions. <laughs> Never mind. And we haven't been offered one either. Ugh. We couldn't buy one either. Now I have no money. <laughs> <sighs> That's why it's in beta. For beta testing. <laughs> oh, jump. Okay. There might be a duck, but just be wary of that. Your jump is fairly far, so... Oh, you, I did the same thing you did. Yeah, it's very far. And, and it's also a little arced. It's quite it's arced arc, and yeah. slow, yeah. Oh. So far, excellent. Oh, it's, Matt, it's a rhythm game. Ah. See, he, he made a game like this. <laughs> Right, left. Oh, it's just left, right, up, down. But buttons would be easier. <laughs> <laughs> There's not enough buttons for that. I was going left. Right, oh, up, down, run! Right. Like you literally cannot beat him. Mm -mm. You just don't have enough. And that's why you run. Run, <gasps> slime, slimer, slimers. Lost, Eight. Lost oh. his shape. Now I really have no money. <laughs> what happens when? You literally have zero dollars, and <laughs> is the game over? <laughs> if you are wounded, you'll have to pay five C on in to full recover. Oh, there we go. We get some money. I like that. Ding, 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 ding. It's nice. We need to get more of those. Yeah, I think that's only the second time we got it. We got it right away. Oh, oh. if you're wounded. Oh, so... It Every time you go around, if you don't have full hit points, you actually lose money, but you gain the hit points. Yeah, you need uh, it though. Yeah. Oops. Damn it. Slime attacks. 
I like the slime. Yeah. It's very menacing looking. So if you miss, you will lose a hit point for sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah. More experience. Is there experience on the main screen somewhere? No. It's a hidden uh, amount. Yeah, you have your level, though, which yeah. I assume is related. Yeah. Nope. Uh, what shall we buy? Uh, oop. Not available. Because we're not 50. high enough. Uh, 150, 300, what should we buy? Nothing. Because <laughs> we're not even close. <laughs> not even remotely close. I think we have less money than when we started. Oh, let's see how terrible I do. Oh, you'll do better than me. It's like watch, like you have to play like a computer plays. Um, this like game, watch it the whole time. Because the computer just tracks it perfectly. Yeah. It's kind of better to stay in the center almost a little bit. And then you have the best chance of... I don't know. You were tracking it pretty well. And it's a lot of work. <laughs> it's I'd hard. Rather not. I'd rather stay in the center. You can't too. chase it is basically the thing. You can't chase it. Did I lose two? Yeah, you can't chase no. it. I want the horsey again. Yeah, <laughs> we'll find the horsey. Oh... Uh, Oh, uh, it's impossible. <laughs> it's so uh, hard. What I would do... So hard. I want to play this one. Okay. Oh. Let's see what we can do here. Don't take too long. Because puzzles are the death of <laughs> people watching. They're like, nah. We're not watching this for two hours. Watching puzzles. <laughs> oh, got one piece in place. Oh, you can have two pieces in place. Yay! Technically three, because this because the empty spot's in the right spot. Now arrange the left hand side with those two. And then It's pretty easy. I programmed with a starting point that made it possible to solve in less than 30 moves. Indeed. Well, that, that's definitely the assumption. <laughs> oh, 30. Does it start with 40? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm sure you can figure it out. Yeah, you just have to really... I mean, if you get enough practice. Uh, oh, no, those two are backwards. But... Oh, no, they're not backwards. That one is. That's okay. Yeah. Ooh. I might get it. Maybe. Yeah. I think. I think you'll get it. I think you got it. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. And uh, no, one's mm, backwards. I hate that. Um. You're gonna have to like throw one into rotation and then put it back out of rotation in a different order. Do people like sliding puzzles? Well, some people do. <laughs> um, I, re I think they're always included in Christmas crackers for those of you who are British or Canadian. <laughs> <laughs> of which there are very few of you watching that are British or Canadian. Um, they're little things you pull at uh, Christmas. And there's like toy, cheap garbage toys inside. Yeah. This is one of those things. There's a little for everyone. <laughs> Ten moves? I think you could do it. You have to... <sighs> no, I don't know. Thinking. Oh, you also have to get that one up out of the corner, too. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm looking at. But the corner and the one above the corner is in the right place if you rotate those out. And it might just solve itself if you do it. No, you it only... won't just solve itself. Just do it. You don't have enough moves left anyway. Do it. Do it. I don't know what you're asking me to do. Oh, yeah. Then move the top over. No, don't do that one. Those are all fine. Why would that work? Move over. Then that one up. Up. Because then, oh no, no, because that was in the right 
order I, and then to what, go to the top corner. And then what do you do? Move it back. Move that one up. And then you move this over? Yeah. <laughs> do it. Then down. And then down. And then over. And then up. And then that one over. Then that and one up. That and that one, one over. And it would have worked. Yeah, you got enough moves. We're a, few, a few away there. Hey, I've just done it. 12 moves <laughs> left. Yay. Yay. We want to land on that horse and get more than three things. You can do it. You'll need the skull key. Where's the closed tile? It's the locked one over there. Oh, okay. I was looking oh, at that three, myself. Three, four. <gasps> you can do it. Yes. They only hit for one? I know you only hit for one because you only have... No, he's hitting for two. Run! <gasps> he's run, hitting for run, two? Run! Run, run, run! Run! No, you have no potions. Run! Uh, run! Okay, get a one. Ah! Oh. Flackett says, I got a potion. Where did you get a potion from? There's a potion square. There's two potion oh. squares, I think. And we've never been on Well, them? we probably never solved okay, it. Let me do this one. Okay, you do that one. Oops. See? Oops. Ah! Ah! You have to get the rhythm of it. Oh, it was Do Re Mi. That was the name of his game that he uh, made. Mm, yep. Ugh. I was pretty good at that game, if I remember correctly. <laughs> Not doing super hot here, but... Can you press it any time? I think you can press it any time before it gets to the bottom. Hmm. 57. So what I got? That's well, pretty you failed, good. But would you get gold? Well, you eventually fail. Yeah, what do you get? Nothing. Nothing. You just play. Yeah. Just a game. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing yet. Ooh, I'm going to run. Because I'm going to die, guaranteed. Yep. And then there goes all the money again. <laughs> Down to 17. Uh... Two spaces. So... My turn. Oh no, it's your turn. You took over for me, so... Because I hadn't played that one. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we can attack now. Get that broccoli. Die broccoli. <gasps> Broccofoli? What was it say? Broccafoli. Broccafoli. <laughs> <laughs> it is a broccoli. If you I win, you get 74 gold, so you have to hit 74. Oh, is that the idea? I was getting there. I think oh, another you, you turn I would have got you it. You could do it, I think. Yeah. If we don't get the horse, we're going to move on. This, this <laughs> round. Oh. Do I have limited bombs? Yeah, I do. Out of ammo. So What do you do? Catch them? You just get gold. As many gold as... No, oh, you have to shoot them. I thought it said you have to catch or destroy 20 bombs. Yeah, I missed two or three. No, you got them, though. You hit a bomb every time. N no, I missed one at least. Did you? Yeah. Oh, okay. But you still got 19 gold? Yeah. I guess you oh, get a well, big you, prize. That's good. You Whoa, got what is giraffe? Oh, he's just like, hey. Nothing to say. <laughs> He's quiet. <laughs> That's a new one. That's you cool. wasted the first. Oh. Okay. Oh. Because I started and then it shot immediately. Mm. I think it might need a. It, it bounced. Needed need to debounce the button. Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh. Yeah. We'll attack him. Ice spider. Ice spider. Metal lunar seven. Well, giraffes don't talk. <laughs> true. Giraffe don't make sense. So it is it's very very accurate. true. I don't know. They must make a noise. Wah. Yeah. <laughs> US4. No, that's from some show. Somebody pretending to be a giraffe. And that's what, what noise it? they made. Wah. Wah. I can't remember what show it was. Yay, level four. <gasps> Two. Three. Four. Yes. And dead. No. <laughs> okay. James is We're done. done. <laughs> Done. 
We gave this a good go. Uh, <laughs> I only have four. Lose all our money. How do you get 150 coin? <laughs> you have to get them all. <laughs> you have to. It's a key. I like it, though. Ah. Oh, yeah. It's an excellent start. Oh, my. You're going to die. You're trying to die? Oh, sure. Why not? Game over. Oh, get to got, see the game over screen. Got the Mary, Mary Tyler Moore a game over screen. Nice. Like, that's literally what it is. I believe he said that, that mm -hmm. he got that from that. Mm -hmm. Super awesome VHZC. Very cool. Great start to it. Yeah. Um, yeah, what what does it need? It needs somehow to get more gold because <laughs> we've got none. Yeah, we weren't. I mean, I suppose that level after four you get better at the mini buy. games, you'll you'll get more. But uh, it's a bit stingy with the gold. It is a bit stingy. It doesn't feel like you go up very much around you. <laughs> no, it's like your levels going up and your monsters are getting harder, but your gold is not going up. Yeah, because we needed a weapon to really do yep. well. Yep, yep, yep. Um, but super duper awesome. Here you go. What are you doing? Okay. Just dealing with it. Okay. We're going to move on to the next game. Um, thank you for posting that, VHC, and thank you to... I can't remember who um, alerted, alerted me Black to that. Black was it? Because it was like posted two hours before the show. I remember now. Impossible yeah. for me to do it, to put it in the show. Mm. Um, Cribbage Squares Solitaire by Hot Rod, who is in the chat tonight. Nice. Um, so let me switch back to the uh, Atari 2600. Mm. So you got a double dose of VHZC plus VHZC's t-shirt. Mm -hmm. Actually, I'm going to show um, VHZC's uh, uh, Iran t-shirt. Mm. Um, Free TV 12 says, tough act to follow. Oh, Always, it is. Uh, <laughs> it's tough, v yeah. v VH VHZC. Let's get rid of this. But we are still very excited about your game, too. Oh, all games are good. No, I'm, they're I'm, all just. I different. like card games. Card games. Card games. Oh card yeah. Card-related games. Yeah. So here's uh, VHZC's T-shirt for the mm. Iran game. Um, very very cool. It's mm. the cover, at least the cover I have right now for the cartridge. Mm. Um, so I'm not sure what VHZC's plans for the game are, mm. whether he's going to put on cartridge or it's just. Just, just gonna, form yeah, just yeah. in binary that you can download because you can mm -hmm. download the full game right now. Mm -hmm. um, it's fun, um, kind of jumping mini game kind of thing. Mm -hmm. It's got a lot of great graphics on it. Uh, going for it. Um, so let me load up the next game. Uh, so let's switch back to the Atari. So it's uh, Cribbage Square Solitaire. If you want to load that up, please. And we are definitely going to have to read the instructions for this because I have no idea. I have played play cribbage. cribbage. You use a cribbage board. I do not remember the exact rules, so you're going to have to go over that. I remember my... I have played it before. Grandparents playing cribbage. Yeah. And I remember it being a like... fairly simple game. It's all just, just you know, adding up your score and, and, and it wasn't it like usually on a wooden board with little pegs and, and it was like, into like yep, a circle yeah kind and, of you, thing. and you're keeping score you're just yeah. you're just going up the board but I, it's been a while so this is made by hot rod this yes. first posted june 8th 2020 this builds from december 10th yesterday brand nice. new it's 4k game this is his first game so oh, excellent um he said, presenting the latest entry in the most exciting genre for your 20, Atari 2600, Solitaire Card Games. Yes. Cribbage Squares Solitaire. Yeah. I've been posting about it in the Atari 2600 programming forum, but I figured I'd let people over here know. Calling this a beta release. Hope you'll check it out and definitely report any bugs you find. Summary rules. You're placing cards in a 4x4 grid mm. to form eight cribbage hands. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight cribbage hands. Uh, horizontally and vertically. There's a 17th starter space in the fifth row. This card is shared amongst each of the eight hands formed by the grid. So kind okay. of like a poker hand. Yeah, yeah. Uh, try to place the cards mm. to score as many points as possible. Like poker. Cribbage sco hands score. Two points for every combination of cards that adds up to 15. So aces are one, faces are 10. Yeah. All others are face value. So, so you you're want, adding up to 15. You want 10 and a five, a nine and a six. No, no, but you've got four cards plus a fifth. 
Is that what he said? Um, but I, I remember now from Cribbage that you can use, you can combine. Like if, if you've got a 10 and three fives, that's like 15, 15, 15. Oh, yeah. okay. So if you've got a 10 and a 5, a so 10 get, and a 5, you, get you can go 10, 5, for every, every, 10, 5, 10, 5, it's, 10, 5. It's two, two cards. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, I remember. For, no, for every combination. You can do three. Um, Even three? Yeah. Two points for every pair. This means three of a kind is six points because okay. there are three distinct pairs. Similarly, four of a kind is 12 points. So matching, the more match, the better. This is always one of the card games I always wanted to learn, like Bridge, Kev Kelly says. Iran is kind of too small to get a physical release, mm -hmm. in my opinion. That's what I was kind of thinking, too. Hey! Hey! No, hey, I'm trying to understand out. what you're saying. Placing cards in a four by... You're placing them in a four you'll, by four You'll grid. see it. You'll Perform understand. Form eight cribbage hands horizontally and vertically. You'll see it. It's, it's four... It's like 16 cards, and the fifth one, or the bottom corner one, counts for all of them. And three fives would be a 15 as well. Ah, yes. Any kind of 15. Hey, we're doing a show. You'll figure it out. You can't sit in silence. Shush. I need my notes. You can't There's sit in silence. There's a starter space in the fifth row, and this card is shared. Yes. So it, does it have to be included? It doesn't have to be. You get points for making combos. It doesn't detract. It adds to help you. Okay. Uh, one point for every card in a run of three or more. Aces are low only. So ace two three is three points. Ace two three four is four points. Ace two three four five. So you get a run. Five points. Easy enough. But there's also hands like ace two two three. This is six points for the two distinct runs. So it'd be ace two three, ace two three. Because you have two twos. Mm. Uh, similarly, ace two 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 three is nine points for the runs. So ace two three, ace two three, ace two three. Uh, I'll leave four five, four five six six to the reader. Four five six four five six, four five six four five six, and then four five six four. That's a lot. Don't forget your fifteens. Oh my god! And then four points for a flush. If every card in a hand except the starter is of the same suit, oh, you got a huge score, score four. If the starter is also the same suit, score one extra point for five. So there's so many combos. Oh my goodness. And one point for knobs, a.k.a. the right jack. If your hand contains the jack of the same suit as the starter card, score one point. Oh, my mm. God. Okay. Get it going. Hey. I'm thinking. <laughs> oh, I see. So you place your cards. Right now, it really doesn't matter where you place that eight because there's no... It, it, every space is equivalent. So now, it depends if you want... A combo of king and eight which no doesn't really connect they're not the same suit you could do a run like an eight nine is in a run eight and a, a nine and a king doesn't like they're close to they're closer than oh, the I eight see. right Wait. oh you oh, can that's place the that shared card so oh, you my might goodness. want that as a five the oh, shared i don't know like, the first game's gonna be terrible anyway so. yeah from Wikipedia, Cribbage Square Solitaire, also known as Cribbage Squares, is a solitaire card game based on cribbage which can be played using a deck of playing cards. The game works the same as Poker Squares, but with cribbage scoring. 17 cards are used, although there are variants that increase the level of strategy by dealing extra cards to the players and more choice of what to use. Cribbage Squares have been implemented in several software programs that contain collections of solitaire games. This is one of those games that's actually better on the computer. Because you don't have to add it up. Because that's the painful part. Yeah. Um, because if this was a card game in front of you, you'd have to go, oh, da 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 Oh, and then there's another combo. This is, I'm, yeah, this is a terrible starter right now. But you've got two 15s there. Ace two, three, you could do there. Oh, pair of nines, you could do. So the pair gives you what? They're also all the same. Don't they have suit. to add to fifteen or no? Well, that's one way to score points. The other way is pairs, triplets, or 15s. runs. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm doing terribly. Um, <laughs> and you can have a flush, if oh those are different. Never mind. Those are clubs and spades. Diamonds. And sorry, face cards are ten, right? Yes, and aces are one.
Free TB12 says 899. What would that be? 899 doesn't. And then hope for a 7 or 10. Well, you didn't do 899. Yeah. That's okay. So Jack is 10. Yes. So, but you want 8, 9, 10 Jack. So if you put Jack on that same line as 10 King and 5, you get Yeah, 10, get five. 15. Yeah. Yeah. But, That's hmm. another 5. You could put the 5 in the corner and that would be a ton of points for that jack anything anything oh yeah you're right you kind of right. want the five there because everything with it that's worth 10 points would give you it adds up so if you've got a lot of tens a five there's awesome yeah let's do this five in the corner he did say five in the yeah, corner. yeah 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 that makes sense now ace two three that's a good one yeah uh mm. six and a nine if is good so that row would be fine yeah so you have Somewhere. to figure out where to place that six none of them nope, are great nope. you could hope for a there. six five Ooh, four put a five there Ooh. yeah yes that's yeah and i want a good. one i don't think i'm gonna have one but. eight 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 nine ten yes yeah oh that's good one, jack but... uh, queen and five that's good 68 points yeah eh. turn Two up top, nice choice. <laughs> okay. Five in the corner, yeah. So remember, sixty-eight. Yeah, I, I, I get this strategy. It uh, you have to play a little bit to figure out your strategy. So but, yeah. the first one doesn't matter. Well, much. ace is a low, low number. But if you put it there, it's that and that. If you put it there, it's that and that. It doesn't matter where you put the first card, unless you want it in the corner. Yeah. But you shouldn't place your first card in the corner. You don't know what you're getting, so I don't care. Uh, ace and ten don't really match up; they're very far apart. Yeah. So I'll put it there. Five, five in the corner. Well, we don't know that. No, you know. yes, you know why? Because why? most cards are worth ten points. The so vet always a five. Yes. Yeah. Pretty good. Honest? <laughs> Pretty good. Uh, we're figuring it out as we go. The reason is because most most cards are ten. Sure. The ten jack king and king queen and king are all 10 worth 10 points so the five in the corner gives you 15 with every yeah so every 10. there is no 11 so the best you can hope for See, is and that's, an and ace that's and pretty four. good yeah but i don't want it with the 10. so it makes the most sense so to 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 get keep your ace and four together yes um and then you can put tens in between so i want that five with the 10 but do i want it with the four because it's a run yeah you could yeah I could do a six and a seven. Or you could put the seven in that corner. If you get a six, you might get lucky. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. And I want ten there because it's a yeah. a heart with the ace. Or you could put it below the ace, right? Ace, four, and ten is fifteen. Yeah. You've already, so you get fifteen and you have the two tens together. You get fifteen here. Yeah, but there are a lot of ten oh, cards. Oh, that's true. So yeah. I guess it doesn't really matter. Seven, eight. Sure. you got to put it somewhere, so... But seven and eight is fifteen, right? Yes, mm -hmm. seven and eight is fifteen. Yeah. So I should, and it doesn't really go there, and it doesn't really go there. Yeah, I, w I would put it there. Queen, uh, I went alongside the tens. Uh, or no, just put it ace ten because you don't get three of a kind for that, uh, so you might as well. Yeah. Um, eight. I get a pair. With that. Yes. Yeah, if you get a nine. But then you'd have to put the nine there, which isn't the greatest, but that's okay. Yeah. Seven, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine, pair, yeah. 15. Yeah. Um, that's the pretty nine good. doesn't really match with the tens. Yeah. Six. Yes. Yeah. King. Uh, well, anywhere. Um, that doesn't help there. King and five helps. King and five helps. Yeah. There. Or there doesn't really match. I, I don't I don't think it matters. King too Queen much. is a better run. I could get a Jack. Uh, yeah. On that row. Possibly. Ooh, triplets definitely there. Don't you think? Because sure. I get the points for the triplets. Sure. And a uh, Queen. You could do two Queens there. Yep. You still get all the fifteens. The eight doesn't help you, but that's fine. Uh, Ooh, double King. I could put it there. Double King. That doesn't. Those are your two options. And a three doesn't matter. Uh, at this point. <laughs> 76. That's a good game. Yeah. 
I can't see any bugs. No. <laughs> I mean, it's placing cards and it adds up unless there's a, a, bug, nice. a bug in the adding, which mm. I'm not going to do because I don't know all the rules. Mm. Uh, so you want to do one more each because mm -hmm. it's pretty quick. Yeah, it doesn't take too long. Scott Lennox says, this is pretty cool. It is. And it's one of those games that has a benefit of being on the computer. Any game that has so much adding or a game that has tons of pieces, like little pieces, like say a game of um, Risk, right? It has all the little pieces that you have to put all over the place. Oh, you're just slamming them down. Packeret says, this is interesting. Love cribbage. Mm -hmm. Yes. And now you need to make a patch <laughs> for a cribbage patch. I think I have some more notes from him while you're doing your do turn. Well this turn, but that's okay. The original post. Come on. Wakey, wakey. Wakey, wakey, tablet. There we go. Almost. Oh, there we go. Hot Rod said on June 8th. I didn't mean to do that. Double. Yeah, I double tapped it. Um, Hot Rod, there's something to put in. Is put a slight pause where it doesn't read your input mm. uh, from the from at least the fire button. I have no fire. So that it doesn't accidentally do a double placement um, because the Atari will read it immediately. Mm. And that's a, that's a problem with a lot of games where you can do two things in a row really fast. Um, I would put a small pause where it's like ignores the button. Uh, after 20 years of thinking about it, I decided it was time mm. I'm, I tried to make something. Here's a very ugly but mostly functional prototype of cribbage squares. This is an old version he's talking about. The aim is to arrange 16 playing cards. Uh, the fire button starts the game, etc., etc. This is my first Atari 2600 code, my first assembly code of any time, so any kind. So he did this in assembly. It's really, really bloated, he said. <laughs> I worked out the logic and scoring first, and then borrowed a six digit kernel to use a display routine, a 16 six digit kernel to display routine, to see if I could get something functional. Good, something functions. Bad, I understand the six digit display routine. In broad strokes, but not enough I can manage to even center it on the screen. So he's fixed all that. Um, expect, expected source of trouble. There must be an elegant or fast method of scoring cribbage heads, but this ain't it. Oh, 58. That was not very good. The timing definitely goes off the rails for a few frames while your score is being calculated. Props to Andrew Davy, Spiceware. Like it. No, it's my turn. Steve, <laughs> Stephen Hug and Gustavo Pezzi and the Atari Age community for putting the resources out there that allow a beginner to get started. I want to see a version of Millie Born. Have you heard of that? Must be a card game. Any card game is improved mm. by computer because no shuffling. I like to play Dominion, but the constant shuffling of the small decks is brutal. Well, there's some uh, card players in the chat <laughs> that no card games. Games, board games, card games. Yeah, yeah. it's all good. It's true. Uh, I guess you get a little bit faster as you play because you're like, you yeah. know, you can see start seeing patterns. Too happy with the way this is going. No, not super great. That eight would have been better on the seven row, because you would have got a combo of eights and sevens. Uh, maybe. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Put on the. Oh, I put the jack there. Damn it. <laughs> oh yeah. I mean, I have ten jack queen king, which is, which is fine. Yeah. I mean. Millie born. Oh, it's a French, so I'm saying it wrong. Millie. Born, 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 I don't know. Mil? That, mil, mil born. born. Thousand something? Yeah, mil. Uh, based on, uh, your glass is too tall today. But basically it's a car race game that's lots of fun. Uh, free TB12 mm. says, I'm a card games guy. Uh, my time programming, this is the time I would have spent on at the poker room if not for COVID. So instead of losing money at poker, you made an awesome game. <laughs> Oh, held an uh, held a message. Well, we're gonna allow that message. Did I, what? I didn't see that. That was held. There oh, we go. It happens. Yeah. What did he say? French, French based. That's why it held it. It highlighted French based. Really? <laughs> what is French based? Uh, do I want to put that there? I think so. Maybe it's like, oh, you're talking bad about the French. We're not gonna let you do that. 
Oh. 69, yeah. That was better. The last round, I was like, is there a five coming up? So, five. seven, a nine. Uh, yeah, let's car put it there. Race, car race card game. Cool. A ten, seven, eight, nine, ten. Sure. sure. A queen, we'll put that alongside the ten. A Ooh, five. Definitely put a five. Tens, or in the bottom corner. Should I just go yeah, from the bottom? I I've already so. got two cards. I think it just makes sense. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah, ten. That's a run. Uh, I can Almost hope for a run another if five. you get a, j a jack, you get a run. Ooh, yes. or a f or a f but the, you, yeah, you nine and a six. Uh, nine and six Maybe gives you fifteen. There. Yeah, sure. An eight. Uh, seven and eight. It gives yeah, you fifteen. It's doubles there. Yeah, maybe I'll try for seven eights. Yeah, and then doing a jack. better. Yeah, do the jack in the bottom. Uh, I've got sixes again, and that's another fifteen if yes. I put that along oh, there. Oh, you're doing well this time. The uh, two goes with man, nothing. Else. It's, it's, that's a pretty. That's maybe we'll put it there because I could hope for another run up top there, like five, six, seven, seven, eight, nine. Eight, eight, two and eight give you 15. Ooh, yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Or you put it at the right top, there. yeah. Uh, two queens, I guess. Yeah. Uh, I could put it, put there, it there and I hope for a five on that row. Um, Ooh, oh, triple queens. Oh, I got my five. Four, four, five, six. Yes, four, five. Yeah, four, and five, six, four, six, seven, eight, six, and five. Two sixes. Seven, yeah, nine. that was good. One point higher. And in that, I retire. Yeah, I've never gotten 100 points. I feel like that's a patch score. Or yeah. 121 because a cribbage game is 2 121. Oh. Mm. I'd say 100 would be a good patch score because. Yeah. Good. I, I, I thought that was pretty good. I think you've got a good set of like cards. S t 10 jack queen king i've got triple queens i've got mm -hmm. a 15 row i've got a 7 8 9 10 there mm -hmm. i've got 7 8s 15 like tons and tons yeah. of going on yeah nice. but i still only got 79 mm. 100 for sure yeah oh he's somebody's making a terrible pun why was six afraid of seven because seven eight nine <laughs> Boo. okay we're going to move on to the next game. That is an awesome. Very good. Simple, great Simple card and game. fun. I like card games. Yep. Ready. So if you want thank to Thank you for making the game. Yes, thank you so much. And for coming into the, uh, In the, into chat. the chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the next game we're going to be playing is UFO Redder. R-E-D-E-R. -E -E Reader. Uh, Redder's, Redder's UFO. Redder's UFO. So this is... Uh, oh, wait. Load up the graphics. That's one thing I didn't get ready. I was panicking because we had water coming into our house. Oh yeah, there's a plumber over. Yeah, I had a plumber over looking, looking for the water. Uh, good times. Good oh, times it, with water. It rains a lot where we live. Yeah. And uh, water in coming into homes is not good, but it okay. is likely related to plumbing. So. Yeah, most likely plumbing, not the water. So this is first posted February twenty first, two thousand seventeen. This build is from February 21st, 2017. Load it up. I'm eating my raspberries. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a 4K game. Other games, Handy Pick Hank, mm. Casey's Crazy Nightmare, Keep Away, Shield Shifter, which we played, Strip Off, which we played, Strip Off 2, and UFO. You can download this in the Atari Age forums. Mm. It was released on cart on the mm. 2600 Connection website and the Tractical Neuronics site, which is his site. So it says, protect Earth from a sinister invasion of mysterious, unidentified flying objects. You are now in command of one of Earth's Federation's robot-controlled battle cruisers. It is displayed at the center of your screen. Not yet. Uh, your ship is armed with a laser cannon and protected by an energized force field. Mm. So go for it. You're a, shoot, you're a ship and you're shooting things. And it's got crazy shots that you can direct. Loop around. Oh. <laughs> yeah, don't run into things. Yeah. Um, this was originally an Odyssey 2 game. And I will uh, find the video of the Odyssey 2 game so we can take a look at it and compare it. 4K means something else to all these kiddos these days. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah, all these 4K games are not like what they think of 4K games. Well, there's a little dot that's uh, 
pursuing you. Is it pursuing me? Yeah, don't touch it. Okay, good to know, good to know. Yeah. 13 points. Um, objective, score points by killing the alien ships while protecting yourself. Press the button on the joystick to start or restart when the game ends. The Odyssey game is great and only 2K, Packrat says. Asteroids on acid. Yeah, it, it is, is on acid. <laughs> it's crazy it's weirdness. It's pretty fun, though. Yeah. It's like this crazy dot that you kind of control. Uh, controls within the game. Joystick, move left or right. Uh, button is fire laser. <laughs> it's crazy. I'm not entirely sure. I feel like I'm swinging it around. I don't really know what I'm doing. You can shoot directly at things. Kind of. Not really. Oh, because you're letting go of your... You're letting go of your shot, so it's like... Oh, you're cornering yourself. Oh, and it's also a shield. shield. So when it's on you, it, it functions as a shield. So you can run into things. Why is that fire Sort flashing? of. Um, game rules. You score one point for each alien destroyed. Your weapon is also your shield. When not actively firing, it quickly circles <sighs> your spaceship, serves as your protection. This is not solid, so you may be killed when hit from the right angle at the right time. You can use your shield to destroy enemies, but it needs uh, a moment to recharge every time it's used. Uh, beware enemies and mines may get through, so use it at angles where your spaceship will not make contact with the item you're ramming. Once you've launched your weapon's projectile, you can steer it. Beware that you're also steering your spaceship. Your red aiming dot rotates with your movement, Counter which is crazy. Rotates clockwise as you move and indicates which direction your weapon will fire. Oh. Yeah. That's it's how complex. it dictates. It's very, it's very weird because it's like you have to move more to, to move your aiming device. <laughs> I'm, 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 it's, wow. it's, it's really interesting. It's really interesting. And once it's launched, you can keep it launched. Kind of. And destroying things. I'm still not entirely sure what I'm doing, but it's pretty cool. <laughs> it's yeah. pretty cool. Free TB12 says, I like the simple, colorful graphics. Yeah, yeah, it's very basic, but it's all about the control and how to maneuver. Uh, the enemy warrior is the one who flashes. It will launch a magnetic mine that will track your spaceship and try to penetrate your shield to kill you. It only puts out one mine at any time. They are destroyed if they're hit, if they hit any object that's not the warrior the, itself. Ah, there, it just got destroyed by that yellow thing. Yeah. Oh, so it kills everything. Oh. Ah! They kill it. Because it didn't die. 22. Like that. Yes. Note the ex note the excessive use or exclamation points. After all, this is based on Odyssey 2 game. Okay, mm. so we'll take a look at an Odyssey 2 game after I play. Okay. How are the bullets sent out in curves? Um, you kind of... It goes in circles? It's kind of weird. You move it by moving yourself. You move it yourself. when you move. So you're like you're like the changing you're you're changing its angle almost by moving. You're not controlling it because it's going outwards. Well, you are. It's looping. If I move right, it moves right with me. Yeah, but it's looping. If I move up, it moves up. It's looping. It is looping at the same time. At the same time, which is what makes it really erratic. So you kind of steer it. <laughs> like if I move to the left, it'll kind, kind of, of it keeps it in your in your orbit almost yes by moving it it's like you're you're you're, you're creating gravitational pull or something yeah um so you kind of get used to how it moves. it's like a yo-yo on a string <laughs> and it's flipping around it's very unconventional and it's weird that i made that reference it is, <laughs> it is like a yo-yo on a string it's one of the you're most... throwing it out <laughs> and then it's doing the loop to loop that's right <laughs> But, but if you don't move and you fire, it just goes in the direction that you're pointing at. Yeah. But if you start moving, then it starts looping around. It's crazy. Yeah. It's I've never seen this control scheme for a bullet <laughs> I don't in quite get it, but any it's game. <laughs> it's kind of reminiscent of a game we played a long time ago yeah. where your movement is kind of like that. Yeah. Where it was spinning around and you press the button. What? Why are you throwing? You press the button and you moved a bit mm. in that direction. There we go. So theoretically, I could. Oh, it just constantly spins around. I could sit here and just fire <laughs> down. So walk the dog is a valid strategy. Yes. Yep, it is. 
<laughs> yeah, you're trying to walk the dog. Yeah, <laughs> you're trying to keep it, keep keep the um, spinning the going. Spinning. Well, walk the dog is like on the ground, but um, well, no, walk the dog. You have it spinning the on the end of the string. Oh, true. Uh, which is not quite what you're doing. It's it's spinning on the string when it's on you. Yeah. But um, <laughs> you're more doing around the world. Around the world. That's what, and it feels like you're doing around the world. It's really funny. It's like you're looping it around. Well, I haven't died because it's pretty easy to dodge things. Well, so you say. You just stay away from the edge. You do. You just, as long as you're you're paying attention nothing, and nothing runs into you, you just yeah. keep shooting. So it's, it's not... Yeah, crossbow. I was thinking more around the world. Yeah. It's not too challenging, <laughs> I have to say. Um, maybe it gets faster after a bit, but it hasn't gotten any faster. You just don't go to the edge because you never know when something's going to come out. Yeah. And you just dodge everything and you just keep spinning your... Just hold down the button and it'll just keep spinning. Mm. And eventually it'll hit something. Or not. So... I'm going to give up. Because <laughs> it's pretty easy. And then I'm going to hand it back to you and we're going to look up... Uh, yeah. The Actually, Captain Classic, you're right. Walk the dog is basically you're sleeping the the yo-yo and then running it on the ground. Yeah. And again, but it goes out straight. Really weird that I know all these references. <laughs> I used to know basic. I well, did I still too. know. I had I a yo-yo. I had a yeah. yellow yo-yo, like official sanctioned yo-yo when I was I a kid. Still have mine. Oh, I bet you do. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, of course you do. Of course you do. <laughs> Yeah. It's a red one. Yo-yos had a small fad revival in the early 80s. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Which was when I was a kid. And so, yeah, yeah it was... Um, it was very popular in the 80s. Yeah. Was it... Um, and... Was it because of the Smothers Brothers? I don't know. Uh, I'm sure they helped. <laughs> and everybody watching that. knows who... The, well, they may not. How big oh, were they outside of Canada? They were Canadian, right? No. No? No. No, maybe they weren't. So they, they would be known. Everybody in this the channel. Smothers Brothers? Yeah. They had TV shows. Yeah, they did. For a yeah. long time. Okay, I'm done. I can't die. It's too easy. You're finding it super easy. So I'm going to look up with the Odyssey 2 so we can take a look quickly at what it looked mm. like. If I can spell Odyssey. Yeah, Tommy Smothers was once known as the Yo-Yo Man. Yep, that's right. It's pretty cheesy now if you ever watch those old videos. <laughs> uh, oh, let's mute that. Yeah, super cheesy jokes. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we are. Let's take a look at the Odyssey 2 version of it to compare. Let me get over to UFO here. Oh, yeah. There we go. So, yep. Yeah, the ships in the 2600 version are more detailed. The enemies, I mean. Oh, there's a guy that shoots after you. That's not in the 2600 version. Mm. Although uh, the enemies are much nicer in the 2600 version. They are. They're oh, just little their X's. explosions are better. Oh, yeah. this guy has way more bullets, too. So there's differences, a lot of differences. Yeah. I kind of like I kind of like the twenty six hundred one. It's really unique with how you're you're launching your shots. Yeah. Let's have with the lights. Uh, somebody talking. Let's mm. not put that on. Um, hmm. Did he die? Yeah. Interesting. Looks like the shield's more solid, like it's spinning faster. But the basics are all there, so he's kind of adapted it and had to make some changes. Mm. But all the basics are there. Very cool. Um, a little simple. Maybe that that one looks a little harder because there's a guy that comes out and shoots you after a while. Like there's a UFO that comes out and like shoots you. Like there. There, this guy. Didn't last long. Okay. We're going to move on to the next game unless you want to play that some more. No, I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, I expected more chunky sprites in the Odyssey as well. Yeah. yeah. Diablo was a more interesting toy. A Chinese yo-yo. Mm. Oh, I, oh, I that think one. that's where it's not on, like it's not attached to the string. Like it's loose. I oh. think I've seen those before. They, they throw them off and they catch them on the string. 
Is that the where there's two two like two um sticks and a string between it no. and you throw it? No, that's something I, else. I think you just do you have a string and it's a loose yo yo? Oh, Captain yeah. Classic says I am correct. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know where I saw that or how I know that, but I think I've yeah. seen it like once. It looks way harder to, to control. Um Oh, thank you, Breeze and Sky, for following and watching mm -hmm. Zero Page. We're going to move on to the next game, which is Encaved by Simon Quernhorst. Um, this was first posted in 2006, September 26th. This build is from May 24th, 2020, uh, 2007. It's a 4K game. Other games he's made. AVCS Tech, Tech Challenge, which I own on cartridge. Mm -hmm. um, Encaved Kite, which I we played. Mm -hmm. We played Mental Combat, played AVCS Challenge, played Raster Fandong. This is the last game we have not played of his. Okay. And so I'll complete the set. You can download this from Simon's website. Um, somebody said something? No? no, someone said, no, those are devil sticks. The thing you're talking about with the sticks. And no, but tossing. devil sticks are, you have a stick in between and you toss the stick in between. Oh, I'm thinking yes. of one where I think it's two sticks with a string and it's something that you throw up in the air. But I might be getting, I might be confusing it, confusing mm. two things. But it, it was like a cone almost, like two cones stuck together. Yes. And they, they were, they were, they were. Yes. Close to, it, it, yeah, I know what you're talking about. You know what I mean. Yeah, I've seen that. Would, you would throw them think, up in the air. Yeah. Anyway. Um, so I got a message from Simon on Monday because mm. he saw us playing his I Project game. Oh, okay. Which I don't have on the list here. Oh. Um, that was the flying one where you go lower and higher. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the older one mm. um, that had a different, like a completely top-down perspective. Are being really difficult. Sorry. Um, he said, thanks. Uh, oh. <laughs> and I also t uh, complimented him on his AVCS a Tech Homebrew, mm. which is a port of a C64 game, which I played a ton on the C64. Mm. He said, thanks for playing my game iProject on your stream. I just checked it out today. Mm. Um, there's a manual coming with the official game cart, which describes the different types of obstacles. The dotted line you are struggling with, she was struggling with, is a fence, so it always raises from the bottom and is either of low height or medium height. Mm. That means you simply can't go below it. Mm. Fly over it, not below. Mm. We figured that out. We figured that out eventually, but yeah. He said, thanks for the kind words on AVCS Tech Challenge. Um, I'll just go big, actually. I don't know why. So small right now. Um, Zookeeper 1. Uh, uh, I've seen some videos of it where people didn't get the meaning of the console switches. They should really read manuals. L please let me know if I can be any help of, of future shows. Maybe you'd like to talk about games which can be played on two joysticks simultaneous, tamious, mm -hmm. simultaneously. Yeah. My game Kite does so. Yes. Um, thanks and all the best. Um, and I said, yes, that's a great theme for a show is double joystick games. Where you're playing too. Yeah. Like Robotron, mm -hmm. which is now called... Robot War 2600. Yeah. Um, so his game Kite, <laughs> where you're you're controlling a kite that's flying, and you have you know the ones with two handles. Yeah. Um, that's what this his game Kite is done by mm. with two joysticks. Yep. Um, there's also Battle Zone TC. Okay. Which was made by um, adapted by Omega Matrix or Thomas Yench. I think it was Thomas Yench. Mm. So I've got three titles that use two joysticks simultaneously. So if anybody else knows mm. of games that use actively two joysticks that, that's a good theme for a show for yeah. movement yeah like not just another joystick for the button but mm -hmm. like you move or shoot with one and those, hold it yeah 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 because after the border opens up i'm going to order the dual 7800 joystick oh, nice. from ed laden yeah so and that works on the 2600 as mm -hmm. well and it's awesome it's like that except two joysticks mm -hmm. yeah tank that's controls true. yes yeah. what, what were you saying uh, no, I was laughing. VH said, see, that thing that looks like a couple of toilet plungers yep. put together. That's exactly what yep. I'm thinking of, but I don't know what it's called, but I remember seeing it. So, load it up, please. All right. Encaved. Uh, the NTSC. NTSC. Bottom. The zip. Oh, God. Yeah, that's not going to work. I was like, that's not a bin file. That's not going to work. That's going to just crash. <laughs> it's going to be like... <laughs> yep. Yeah. I don't want that. 
let me fix that for us. Which is easy to do and pretty quick, but open up the zip, drag out the NTSC, delete everything else so it's not distracting. Pop it out. C if I had a developer cart, which I actually do, but I don't want a USB cable running all the way from there to my computer at all times. I could do that. There you go. And also, if I had the plus cart cart in there and they had that in their listing, it would just be already, already there. This has awesome music. Well, kind of music. It's like industrial. Industrial music. Hey, I, I'm saying listen to the music. You're like, nah. No, but I thought you meant during the game. No. I'm like, that just sounded like static. Oh, I, I can hear it now. It does, have, it does have a background. Where's the chains? You have the right one? Just one second. That's... Really weird. One second. I think you still got the old um, cart on the screen, too. Yeah, I do. One second. Hmm. I want to see what's going on here. Something's happening. Look! Chain's there. Oh! What? That's really weird. Oh, uh, maybe, maybe, um... Oh. oh. Press the button. Mm. Mm. That's mm. very interesting. Let's reload it. Ready. Something is fishy. Something's going on because there's supposed to be chains at the top of it. Load it up, please. Again. Oh, sorry. Hmm. Because on. I see no chains. What? That's super weird. Huh. I'm going to show you guys what it's looks it's supposed like on to look Stella. Like? Oh, really? Because it has chains at the top and bottom. Well, you'll have to keep an eye out and see if anything else is effective. That's super weird. Okay. Sorry, there's two things going at once. <laughs> two sounds that you're hearing, but you're hearing Stella and you're hearing. So let's just take a look at what Stella looks like. There. Oh, it's look quite different. No, but look, look at what's missing there too. Do you oh have the God. right version? I'm playing the exact. There, I will only have one NTSC version. Oh, that's weird. It's really different. Why is it so different? That, that's strange. So this is Stella that you're seeing. This is the 2600. S Stella. 2600 like what like that bottom part is totally different it is totally different That's very and you don't see chains wow this is the most difference i've ever seen in a game between emulation and um... like a really weird difference mm -hmm. not like pixels are broken or something like that like the whole graphics are missing mm -hmm. one second let's go back to this and i'm gonna And there's no reason. Like, it doesn't make any sense. No. Weird. You have developers enabled in Stella? Uh, nope. Let's do that. Let's turn on developer. Nope. Didn't make any difference. Still looks good. Mm. Huh. Hmm. Yeah, everything's developer. Developer. But you didn't... Did you reload the NTSC onto the... Like, uh... Let's load up the PAL. The PAL is really different. Hmm. It's slower, but it's missing a bunch of graphics, the, the PAL one. But this is the NTSC. Hmm. And it looks different. Like, really different. I can't explain that. Hmm. 
I now you see the UFO. I haven't changed. <laughs> James I haven't, is I haven't focused it on the, yeah, the strangeness that's going on. Anyway, we can, we're just going to we'll ignore that. And, I won't and play hope the game. The, hope that gameplay is okay. Yeah, I'm sure. It's just the opening screen. Yeah, I'm sure it's okay. Now, now it can change the. It sounds weird too. It doesn't sound the same. No. It's more scratchy or something. That's weird. Yeah, this is a very very interesting. I will change the graphics now. How I, how do I play this again? <laughs> well, you're going to be playing it because this is my nightmare come uh, true, this game. Oh, it's a... It is a maze in the dark. Oh. There you go. Changed, I've changed the, the cartridge graphic for you guys. Weird that the Harmony ROM is missing graphics, but the Stella version has the chains. Yeah, it's, it's, I have no idea. I'm going to have to look at that a little bit more. I mean, the game is like 13 years old, so I, he's not going to revisit it. He's, he's moved on to C64 games. Um, you have a flashlight. I do? Yeah. You can move around the flashlight. How? Hold, the, hold the button down. Oh, but you can't move with the flashlight. They move it separately. That makes sense. You have six seconds to complete the maze. Well, that's not going to happen. <laughs> you didn't tell me about the flashlight until... No, because I was fiddling with things. Oh. Oh, even the timer is all crazy. Oh, so there are other things that are happening. Now you've got eight seconds. No? I think it's top right. Hmm. Oh no, it's still counting down. What is happening with the numbers? Uh, Unlight Cave Adventure. The end. No. It Should be James' favorite game. Dark Mazes. So no. let's start over because you didn't tell me anything about how this game works. <laughs> <laughs> Retron time. Oh yeah. I bet I bet the Retron would. Um, should we go? Guys, want me to load it up on the Retron? I will, actually. That's a good idea. Ow. It's right in the way. I don't need to be that close. It is Retron time. The SD card is so hard to get out of the Retron buried in there. There we go. Tiny, tiny little nubby thing. Well, Tanya is torturing herself. You like these type of games? Not really. <laughs> Dark maze I don't games. I hate them, but... I mean, they're challenging. Uh, I just don't like the challenge of it. Like, I don't see the, the fun in a dark maze. That's the problem. I could maybe see it if the maze was the same every time. But I don't this... know where the exit is. That's the problem. There's the exit. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. Well, that's not helpful. I'm totally in the wrong place now. You told me it was the top right. Oh. Liar! I don't know. I barely played this game. I haven't read the instructions yet. I'm doing other oh things. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Just making... Yeah, see, I could have finished this like 20 times over. Oh, my gosh. I went totally the wrong way. should start with the... Does it start with the button? It should start with the button. Okay, I've got it on the Retron card now. Then I'm going to read the instructions. And then we're going to take a look at the Retron show. It should show exactly as Stella shows, because it is Stella. I only have one NTSC. I, I just double-checked again. Okay. Now, the story of Encaved. Darkness. Your head aches. Yes, that's how I feel with dark mazes. Uh, where are you? What happened to you? Then you remember a steady beep of a technical device. Oh, you did it. Is it the top middle? Yeah, I think it probably changes every screen. Oh, painful. Uh, then you remember the steady beep of a technical device. You start groping for the source of the tone and find a PDA laying near your legs. You grab it and watch its display. You stare at the screen and can't tell what the numbers stand for. 
Uh, you stand up and move a step to the right and come to know that the small dot on the screen represents your position. You continue walking, but a wall abruptly stops your movement. You're in a giant maze, and the PDA screen shows the map of this dark surrounding. While examining your electronic device in your hands, you find a button and a small stick. Your curiosity and raising panic pu results in pushing the button instantly. You're still standing in complete darkness, but the screen shows something like a spotlight. It seems to be produced by a radar spot scanning the caves. Move the sp small stick while the button is pressed, moving the spotlight around the maze on the screen. You spot ways and walls on the screen and decide to follow the lanes and hope to find an exit somewhere. Unfortunately, you come to know that the numbers in the top right corner of the screen are counting down, and you feel that it can't be any good if the timer reaches zero. Okay. How, where do you get off, out of the screen? A box is hidden somewhere in each maze. Locate it with your spotlight and collect it with your player to gain more time. Oh. So somewhere there's a little dot. I didn't know that. So you might want to look around the screen for the dot first. Another mini game for KGOB. No, please, no. <laughs> oh. The tend. The tend. <laughs> yeah, so, something is something. Something uh, is off. Is awry here because the 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 tens digit is not behaving correctly either. Like, look, Reddy's not behaving right. Mm, yeah, there's stuff. And the tens thing. digits zero. Hmm. Um, scoring. As soon as you found an exit and moved through it with your player, you receive the remaining time as points. So are the exits clearly what they are? Like, they're clearly marked? Yeah. Okay. Well, they're not marked. You just have to find your way there. But you could tell it is an exit? What does it look like? Yeah. That. Okay. Yeah. It's a break in the maze. Mm hmm I admire how people can give convoluted plots to everything. My games are like a dragon stole your cat. <laughs> well, when your game is a dot moving through other dots, you have to get pretty creative. Your games are like spectacles of graphics. <laughs> Not a lot of explanation needed. Like they're so, they look so amazing. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh, shows you the maze for a second. Okay, do you want to check this out on the Retron now? Sure. Yeah. And see what if we it's see. It's gonna work. Yeah. Okay. Let's just use this joystick. And yeah, it's got power, so we should be able to unplug that, plug this in, mm -hmm. turn it on, and it should display. Nothing. It's got power. I guess it helps if I put the SD card back in so it has an operating system. Homebrew encaved. What do you think it's going to show? I think it's going to show the proper thing it's I supposed to work. with chains. Yep, that's interesting. What in the hell? Something in the uh, cart, maybe. I don't yeah, know. some incompatibility with. No, it's this. Oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> but I'm not. Look, gonna look the numbers. See, everything's working. Oh, it's working. actually counting down. Yeah, it looked like zero, but it wasn't zero. It was counting down ten second uh, increments. That is really interesting. I bet the people of Stella w would actually want to know this. Would they? Like, this is this is really weird. Have a good night, VHZC. He says, Hi, VHZC. Uh, Thanks for playing. I didn't expect KGOB being showed so soon. <laughs> yeah. Neither did I. <laughs> you all, we almost didn't, actually. Uh, no, not that way. Oh, am I going back? I think I started wrong. No, you have to, yeah. Oh, it's the same it's maze the each back. time, so. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh. But I'll let you figure it out. <laughs> I know how much you love dark, dark mazes. I love it. Anyway, we we 
we figured it out. Yeah. Be curious, Kool-Aid Man works properly on his 2600. I'm working if it's an odd TIA issue. Shall we find out? Uh, James, I thought Stella showed it properly. It is your Atari that isn't displaying it, right? Yeah, no, no, we realized that. Um, I don't know why, though. Again, it could be the cart. Uh, oh, no, it's still... Yeah, it's weird. Okay. Let's play Kool-Aid Man. Ready. What? There are certain games that have trouble. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, you just uh, went past it. Now, I don't know what the problem is with Kool-Aid Man. I forget. Um, Crossbow, what uh, what does Kool-Aid Man look like? Stop drinking my Kool-Aid. Ah! So everything looks good, but I may be, like, missing what it's supposed to be looking like. Nope, it looks proper. Okay. What's, there's one more as well that is... Has problems? Yeah. Actually, it's listed in Stella, so I should be able to find it pretty quick. It's in the developer options in Stella. Oh, it's on that screen. Oh, on some 2600s with newer T TIAs installed in them, the score digits will be overlapped and cause issues. Mmm. Mm. Here they are. Uh, Pesco. I already know my Pesco is crazy. Mm. Cosmic Arc Stars. Indy 500 Menu. Mm. He-Man title. Anyway. Well, I, I have no idea. I can't diagnose why it doesn't look properly proper. Mm. Very interesting, though. Very, very interesting. Huh. Okay, we're going to move on to the last game now. Uh, which is a s flailing, uh, trying to get a patch. You might get it. Uh, maybe. I don't think I will. <laughs> <laughs> it's not like that last game where I played it and I was like, I just got the patch. How did that happen? <laughs> <laughs> Oops, I got the patch. Yeah. Uh -huh. Very low bar. Very low bar. <laughs> We're going to be playing Pressure Cooker. Excellent. Um, this is game from 1983. It's made by Gary Kitchen, mm. Dan Kitchen's brother. Nice. Um, my copy is trashed. <laughs> it's terrible. But it does work. Plaque has been eating away at it. No, it's actually like ripped. It's yeah. really terrible. Yep. Um, so I think it works. Did we, do you I remember if we, we worked? Mm -hmm. I this can't remember. Time? I can't remember. And it's a burger building game. Yeah. Works yeah, perfect. There we go. Hallelujah. There we go. So let me load up the actual proper cartridge graphics here. Um, pressure cooker. There we go. Boom. Boom. Okay, I'll let you go first. I'll do a little oh preamble. Ah, 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 it started. I am, I'm not moving. Why am I not moving? It, it's not started. Oh. Oh, this is just... There we go. There's yeah. no music. You have to hear the... Like, where is the... Very amazing pressure cooker music. And Gary Kitchen um, posted a blog not too long ago about um Wait, so one of them needs an onion and only an onion so you need a top for so that wait, one do I, do grab I... the top put it on there and then go down and it needs to go to red there we oh, go it's been such a long time yeah so is there any sorry you you need to remind me is there any um anything damaging with letting the toppings yes. not go anywhere yeah you want to push them back so that one needs to go in the blue yeah you, you want need to push top them? for that one. Oh, i see you want yeah yeah one. yeah that's you fine. want to push that one back oh, okay it's been a while i think you run out of, i think you'll either lose points or what no uh you have to put it on a burger how do you, you how do you it. push it i think you press the button to push it back yeah, press the button to push it back. 
Uh, Cafe Class says 45,000. Yes, you are correct. Um, so I will load up the instructions here. It's been a while. And I think last time you were saying, oh, get the lettuce. You need a lettuce. You need a you need an onion. And I don't know if that was helpful. Yep, there is a bear bun, a bear burger to send down to a blue. Oh, it is a bear burger. Now you need three onion burgers. And that goes to green. Yeah. Nope, don't need that. How do, you, how do you hit it back? Press the button. I was, but I wasn't facing or, or it. Or hold the button, maybe. Yeah. That's green. I think you can just hold the button there. to push it back. Yeah. There, that's... So you need a lettuce and an onion for a red. Red. You said a lettuce and an onion, but for that's not what you need. You need a single... A lettuce. Yeah. Now I need an onion for, for a green. green. Uh, why am I not moving? Oh, it's done? It's over. Uh, Don't know when it's over. That's right. Timed? Yeah, it's a time. Now there's two toppings. Ah, it's Now too it gets much. crazy. Ah, I... Why am I not picking it up? It's really sensitive, I remember. It has to be oh. perfectly on you. Oh my goodness. There like we go. into your hands. Like it's got two pixels of difference. So that's blue. It's been such a long time. Oh, I needed that. <laughs> you need everything. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to get this. It's so hard. Oh, I don't yeah, need it. Yeah, that's good. Red. Red. Drop in a red. Oh, just get used to it. Ah! Threw it on the ground. I didn't purposefully. And I didn't <laughs> don't need, that. need that. Oh, Lord. Now you have to destroy that. Or you can let it go, I think. Can yeah. you? Oh, I don't know. If... Oh, God. That's fine. <laughs> it's like I remember playing it, but I don't remember all the details. Okay. I need to, I need to, Here, I need to look at that little spreadsheet on the bottom of what you need yeah it's a little confusing you're reading it lengthwise tomato onion lettuce cheese onion tomato that's what i need yeah and they're single yeah i've read this before do you want me to read it again uh just try and find out things were missing in uh, terms of information um uh, we don't need to know how to play like scoring oh, or interesting. something. Interesting. Difficulty switches. Left of difficulty switch. A plays music only between waves. B plays it continuously. Red. Braid is not used. Lettuce. On a blue. Blue, yep. Tomato. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, you learned, so you, red. you begin with 50 performance points. You can add or lose performance points depending on your efficiency. Ah. You earn 10 each time. Your score increases to 10,000 points. Wow. Yeah. The maximum rating is 99 points. You lose one performance point each time. Any condiment is wasted smashing against the Sam or the conveyor belt. So you don't want to do that at all. Yeah. You lose five performance points each time. You drop a hamburger into the ah. wrong wrapping chute. Damn it up the wrong thing or you miss the wrapping chute wow that takes a lot off and you lose 10 each time a hamburger falls off the end of the conveyor belt so you're better off dropping it in the chute and it oh really so i should drop oh, that no. in the chute if you drop it in the chute you lose five but if it falls off the edge you lose 10 so, so you want to drop it in the chute yes even okay. if it's completely wrong you only lose five instead of 10 okay if you can do that yeah uh, each each time you catch a condiment, you score five. This is not performance points. Performance points dictates when you lose, I think. Um, each time you catch a condiment, you score five. You have 43 performance points. I assume that's what that means. Okay. It's over, because it can't go up. So that was good. Twenty-five, sixty. Not a great start. No. I suck at this game too. I it's think it was hard. our score clubs last season. Oh yeah. It's a hard game. 
Is that what you got? 2560? Yeah. Ah! ah! You only lose one every time you do that. Okay. It's far ah. worse. So I need uh, lettuce. Uh, yeah. And that needs to go to red. Yes. You need to help me, I think. I. Uh, do you want me to read? or So what's the score we need? I need a lettuce. 45,000. Oh, we're not even close. Like, we won't get close for many rounds. Oh. I just... Yeah, 45. Uh, cheese, and that goes with uh, onion. I need help. Cheese and onion, green. Thank you. Okay, lettuce, yeah. Lettuce and, and top for blue. Okay. Nope. Okay, t uh, no tomato. Uh, lettuce and cheese for red. Thank you. Oh, that's so much easier. <laughs> Uh, no tomato, so onion and whatever comes out. Not tomato. Uh, lettuce for blue or red, actually. Yeah. Yeah, the first one down. No. Nope. No tomatoes. Anything. Lettuce yeah. and onion. So cheese can go in the next one. Okay. Oh. Uh, no, you don't want that. At all. No. Oh my god. Onion. Yes. Put on the lettuce, yeah. and that goes to blue. No a tomato. no tomato, so yes, cheese, cheese. Uh, and a topping, and uh, for green, sorry, <laughs> okay. bun. And the bun, sorry, um, no, no lettuce, a uh, tomato, yes, and, that would be and an, an onion. onion, or so no, no lettuce. lettuce, so cheese on the next bun, uh, onion and tomato, and a top <laughs> for green, uh, lettuce, Ooh. and on the onion, on the, on the onion. And uh, an onion can go there. Uh, cheese can go in the onion. And you need a top. <laughs> and that one is going... Nowhere. Oh, no. Red. It doesn't matter. Um, nope. Top. And that goes to blue. This yeah. is so hard. <laughs> uh, sure. Lettuce. And... Oh, no. The cheese is already on there. Oh, onion. Is just, it? Yeah, just put a top. Are you sure? On. Yeah. No, oh, it's, it's red. all good. It's oh, all good. good. Oh, good. This is nightmarish. This is horrible. Caffeine uh, 2D. Just go back. I'm terrible at this game. <laughs> it's a horrible game. I am too. I don't think you saying things is helpful after a certain point. Okay. Well, if just you gets, just you just yeah. want to do it, I'm gonna get another glass of wine. It gets too crazy. <laughs> I'm just gonna get another You're like glass onion, uh, lettuce. Uh, don't get that. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's so hard. Lettuce by itself. Oh, and onion or lettuce by itself. Okay, on blue, uh, cheese. Oh God, uh, onion and a lettuce. Oh my God, I don't need that. Onion and a not an onion. Onion and a lettuce. Yes, and a top. Yeah, for blue. Uh, a lettuce. Yes, and an onion. No, and a lettuce by itself. Oh God. A top, yeah, lettuce by itself. For red. Uh, tomato, an onion. Oh, God. And a cheese, yeah. An onion, yeah. And a topping. See, this game is intelligent. It knows what to give you. Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, just throw it away. Uh, not a cheese. A lettuce again. Uh, an onion, yeah. And a topping, yes. And it goes to green. Uh, a, a tomato, yes, and an onion, yes, and a cheese, a cheese, yeah, and a top, yeah. This is a talk-through game. It is. It, an <laughs> onion, and a lettuce, and a top. Will I give me it? Yes, it will. A green, no! And a topping, yep, and a green, a tomato, yes. And a top. Yep. Goes to red. A cheese, yeah, with an onion. Not a tomato. An onion. A burger top. It's like the kitchen is like, hey, you just want anything? We're just going to throw anything at you. Don't need that. I need an onion. And I need a top. And a green. Jesus. All that work, it's so frustrating. Oh, no, I don't need that. Is it just add? Oh, I think it's okay, actually, to do that. And an onion. Yeah, this is the last burger of this 
Level? I don't even know how levels work. Like, how do levels work? Does that mean I wasted three burgers because it didn't get all 12 of them? Where's the patties? These are veggie burgers. Or maybe they come out with patties. Yeah, see, the patties are coming out. Yeah, there you go. Because it's a bottom bun. I don't need that at all. I want a lettuce and a topping. Yep, that goes to red. Uh, I don't need onions. I need a cheese. And a little... Uh, yes, just a cheese is fine. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, lettuce, yeah, with uh, cheese and a tomato. tomato. So I'll take the tomato. I need a cheese. The I onion can go that. in the next... Oh no. No, it's not there yet. Oh my god. Uh, I need a... Don't need an onion. What do I need? Cheese. I need cheese. Oh, I don't need an onion at all. Oh, there's the there's cheese. cheese. Okay. And then just dump the next one in whatever. Oh, oh no. God. I don't even know what I'm doing now. Okay. Uh, dump the onion. Oh, I could have got that. Yeah. Um, now I need a cheese for that one. Mm -hmm. I need a topping. Yeah. Should I have grabbed that one Green. and dumped it, it first? It doesn't matter at this point. Because I'm dead. Because I ran out of points, yeah. right? You lose 10 for each one that falls off the edge. So. This looks like an amazing game for the hardware. It is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like the graphics, the sound. Yeah. Where are the, the patties? Craziness. The no. patties are on the bottom. They are already there. on the. Uh, I wish someone would make a cheeseburger for me. It does make you hungry for burgers. <laughs> what is this? Uh, one thing to keep in mind is that when you complete a burger, the next topping is the top of the bun, I think. It seems that way. Ah. I'm going to restart it. I don't know how to. I don't know how to. You hold down the button. That's it. Just hold it down and it tosses no, but I it don't, out. I don't. Yeah, that's true. You do have to be at the right height, though. Like if it's hitting your head, it's going to explode. annoying that it even when I'm holding it it doesn't always deflect properly it's what makes it hard I've been failing on putting the burgers in their bins I've destroyed I destroyed like four burgers last it's game. it's a shame because you lose the most points by doing that you oh lose 10 God. points so That's, you really need to be yeah. careful when you do that so we've been beta oh. testing a whole bunch of games Come on. only one we can talk about and only by name. <laughs> Penalt. <laughs> it's the only one we can talk about that we're beta testing. And it's awesome. It's awesome. The other ones are all super awesome, too. Oh, come on. Hitting your head. Oh, you don't need a tomato burger. Oh, I do. Ugh. Thank you. Oh, come on. I'm not paying attention. I wish the wrappers were RGB rather than GRB. The wrappers. Oh, it, the wrappers? What do you mean the wrappers? Oh, you mean on the outside. Oh, on the bottom when you're at the bottom. The little, um, the shoots oh, you put shoot. them down. Yeah, that is a bit uh, frustrating that it's not RGB. But maybe that wasn't a convention, like the order of them. When was I wonder when that was a convention? Like that order, RGB. Is it oh, that? Is it it's that? It's not giving me a top. Because you probably messed up the burger. I did, but then you lose 10 if you mess up the burger? I thought you could pick it up and drop it. I don't know. It actually doesn't matter. You, lose, you get 10 points off either way. Probably because it was the last burger. I don't know. Oh, that's, that makes Might sense. Have been it. You can see the even the patty. Oh, come on. That's really annoying. Come on, come to me. <laughs> oh. What is the patch goal? 45,000. And I got like nine last game. Nine. I was messing up a lot. There was a lot of mess ups and oh, that I could have prevented. Shoot. Ugh. Yeah, you can either destroy the burger you already started. Oh, come on. 
Is that what I need? No, it's not. Oh! oh just fell off the line. Useless. Is it better to smash your head on a... On an item that... Well, it's, you should never have to smash your head on an item. So it doesn't matter. You're not really making that choice. Onion? Uh-oh. Shit. Oh, come on! You're way too high. Oh. Yeah, that was terrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible game. The patch goal is 45,000. <laughs> it's one of the harder ones. It, it's just... I think, It's anyway. so hard, this game. Because there's a lot of thinking And you have to read patterns. a spreadsheet as you're doing it. Like, yes. what game? <laughs> do you have to read a spreadsheet at the bottom of the game to figure out what you're doing? I know. Sorry, I'm, I have spreadsheets on the brain. I was looking at spreadsheets all day today, so... Yeah, RGB would be better for memorizations like RGB. That's yeah. that's the order <laughs> yes. that I need to do it at the bottom. Blue. Oh, yeah, I just need a bunch of onion burgers. Onion burgers. It changes, though, when you come back up sometimes. What? No. no. Yes, I thought well, so. Well, because you... Oh, I guess one replaces. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Only one. The one it's that funny you, you can't finished. even put it on there when it's too far up. Yeah, it's like, come on, yeah. come on. Oh, you have to be oh. right in the middle of it. Ah! Yeah, but where? Like your right body in the middle. or no, the burger? No, the burger has to be right the burger in the yeah. middle. So it's so blue. So if I'm there? Yeah, that's, that's perfect. Fine. Okay. Yeah, you have to, the burger has to be right in the middle of it. That's good to know. It's all these little things. Yeah. Captain Classic, this is an impressive game graphics wise for Activision and in just 4K. The ingredients can oh all be made God. out. The escalator looks like an escalator That's with spinning true. wheels. The chef is recognizable. I 100% agree. 4K? I would have assumed this is 8K. It's That's so crazy. simple, but it looks great. Oops, almost messed that yeah. Up. It looks, and I love Stunning. the little fire stove <laughs> and the bun drops down and if you look the patty drops down too yeah. you can't you don't really notice that when you're playing yeah but like the bun and the patty drop down which is just so cool i wonder what the most visually impressive 4k game is mm. because this this is definitely one of it junk uh, i mean uh pitfall is definitely in the running as well for the most impressive looking 4k game um I wonder what for homebrews. Oh my <gasps> god! You have to have it in the middle. Destroy two burgers, that's why they're not yeah. there. Did pretty good. Escalator Do you get a looks bonus? like an escalator. Oh. If you get all of them? Oh, probably a bigger bonus. You probably yeah. need that to to get the high score, I bet. Don't need that. that. Um... Cheese and onion. Cheese and onion, or cheese and che onion, or, or or cheese and lettuce. Mm. Yeah, cheese and lettuce. Oh, yeah, you're right. Oh, see, I don't like the <laughs> spreadsheet thing at the bottom. I have a hard time reading it. Oh, cheese Ugh, and. I have to get onion. my brain around that somehow. Yeah. And no cheese. Empty. Yeah, there is an empty one. Oh my god, that's the first empty one we've come across. I was surprised. Like, oh, there's an empty one. Lettuce and onion. onion. Uh, green. Uh, tomato, tomato. Plain. Just tomato. Mm -hmm. More fun to watch you guys play it. Because it's Panic <laughs> City. <laughs> yeah. Uh, just on its plain own. cheese. Or, or with onion. Come on. There you go. But I think he, somebody said that they, it will complete if you do it completely. If you do it properly. So, uh, yeah. Onion and either cheese or lettuce. Perfect. That sounds good. <laughs> Onion and cheese and lettuce? Yeah, oh, burger. Sorry. Red. Yeah. Just a burger. We have burgers. We have burgers upstairs still. Uh, I'm... I have to put that on the next one. Lettuce no, and I'm onion. screwed. Lettuce and onion. Anything onion, on well, anything and onion. So knock out anything else off. You want an onion? Put it on. That yeah. one. There you go. Yeah, thank you. Green. And onion. Yeah. Oh. oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's good. It's good. Blue. Oh my god. You were lucky. You were lucky. It's I got, all good. 
uh, cheese yeah. and uh, onion tomato. or lettuce. That's good. Yeah. Oof. Blue. And no yeah. tomato. Cheese. Cheese and, and onion. Onion. Or a plain burger. Or a plain burger. Yeah. So that's good. Red. And then you need a plain burger. So knock it all out. Or no. Or an onion burger. Oh, an burger. onion. I what, need an onion burger that actually. Huh. There you go. Oof. <laughs> oh, I missed one. No, I didn't. No, you got them all. Ooh. Did you get a big bonus? I hope so. Oh, it is 8K. Oh, wow. There you go. This would be incredible. Yeah, nice, nice big Ooh. bonus. I think you need... You need to get that. You need to get all of them. Or are yeah. you just going to be destroyed? Oh, this is... Now it gets insane. Triples. It's a yeah. whole other level. And lettuce or cheese, cheese. or just cheese? Not you. So cheese, lettuce, and... It's green. Uh, yep. Yeah. And then uh, lettuce. And oh, by yeah. itself. Cheese by itself, yeah. That's good, too. Uh, yep. A lettuce and tomato and cheese. Yes. Not, Not an onion. Oops. Tomato. Yep. yep. And then cheese. And cheese. So the people will accept double. double. They will. <laughs> shockingly. It is shocking. And then onion on anything on its by itself is good. Onion, and onion yes. on anything with a lettuce, and that's good. Yeah. Yeah. Right. On the green. Cheese. Cheese and with. tomato and onion. Not that. You need an onion. There you go. Perfect. Lettuce, lettuce cheese, an onion. An onion. Not that. <laughs> So at some point you're gonna have to make two burgers Blue. at once, yeah. and that's gonna be a nightmare. Uh, no lettuce. Uh, tomato tomato by, itself. by itself. Green. Yeah. And then an onion, onion by itself. Onion by itself. And an onion with lettuce. Um, nope. There you go. Whew. Blue. And then that and right. a tomato. Yep. Uh, and blue. And just one more, and then Ooh. I that was close. Nope. Cheese. Nope. You need cheese. Nope. There you go. Cheeseburger just in the red. A cheeseburger. Oof. <laughs> kind of close to. Yeah. It's not much room. Thunkist oh. is here. Thunkist. Hi, Thunkist. There's no pixel in here. There's no cats. They're sleeping upstairs. They're being very shy and past. I asked few them if shows. they wanted to come down. They just looked at me. Well, and they're sleeping on the couch. You did drag one down. I know. Was he wasn't burger. too happy. Plain burger. Maybe there is a bun just going to come out. Oh. Don't want nope. that. I uh, do want yep. an onion. Onion and cheese or. Onion, lettuce, cheese. Lettuce, cheese, yeah. There you go. Good job. Green. Onion, onion. and lettuce and cheese. Or, yep, yeah, and lettuce. Uh, you can put the tomato on the next one, but yeah, you can put that on there. Ooh. Oh, there's a plain. Oh, one. there's a plain burger. Do it. Ooh. What is that? What does this one need? Uh. Oh. Not, Not tomato. tomato. Cheese. There you go. <sighs> Just in time. Blew it up. Uh, I nope. Don't need that. Uh, cheese. Yes, by itself. By itself. Cheeseburger in blue. Like it literally didn't give me that to the last second. So onion and tomato. Everything needs onion and tomato. Well, that's nice and easy. Onion and tomato. Green. Onion. onion. Not the cheese. All right, you can do yet. the cheese, not but yet. yeah, put that on the next one. Oh, tomato. Yeah, it's not coming fast enough. Then onion. Oh, <gasps> nope. Oh, oh no. no. Tomato on the top, and then an onion on the top. And then should I? No. Nope. Should I put on that? It doesn't matter. Because I lose less. You've lost it anyway. Oh. No, no, that's there. You go. You lose ten regardless, so you might so as well let it, fall let it off. fall off. Oh, oh okay. you don't need that. Yeah, you've already lost ten points at that point. Uh, you need a cheese by itself. Oh. 
What do I need? A cheese. Well, you just... Or an onion. What are you doing? Pick up an Where? onion. There. On this the one? top. Yeah. The, you have nothing that needs lettuce. That has to fall off. It does? No! Oh, it doesn't no. matter. You're just wasting your time, I think. I think you lose 10 regardless. So oh, you might okay. as well just let it fall off once you do it wrong. Oh, okay. Lettuce by itself. Oh. No. That's okay. That's good. Yeah. Uh, cheese, cheese by, by itself. itself. That's a, is that your last? Yeah, I think so. Nothing else is coming. I've destroyed two of them. That's not the worst. <laughs> yeah. Cubert is 4K. That's pretty good. Real sports volleyball? Okay. Setting sun and the shark coming out. I'm pretty sure what it said is you lose 10 for it falling off and you lose 10 for putting it in the wrong one. Oh, so just let it go once you've made it. I bad believe one. so. I'm going to double check that actually. Yes. But please. I think that's what it said, so it doesn't matter. Singles. This is not getting harder yet. It's not faster. There's not like super complex. Maybe it's going faster. I don't know. Uh. Oh my god, that was ridiculous. Because it got a little crazy. Oh, I at take first. that back. You lose five if, it, if you drop it in the wrong chute. Oh, oh no, no. What is it? <laughs> I need to know what to do with bad burgers. What's happening? It's so slow. Onions, 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 onion. There we go. Mm. So put Oh it my god. Just like just destroyed a burger. Because your position changes if you straighten up. Everybody's right. Onion burgers. Just tons of onion burgers. Tomato. You can do a tomato burger. Blue. Yeah, onion burger. I do like onions on burgers. Yes, they're very good. Bread. Nope. Yep, plain. Yep. Good job. And that's the last one. Um, There's no say? pause in this game. Like, even at the end, it just keeps going. You can't figure it out? So, no, it says you lose five points, performance points, each time you drop a hamburger into the wrong wrapping chute. Okay, that's five But it there. doesn't say what? if... Maybe if, you lose nothing. No, you lose ten when it drops off, dro drops off the edge. Okay, so you want to put it in a chute. Why did you... Did you play or did it automatically play? It automatically. Okay. So you lose five in the wrong chute, but it doesn't say if you create the wrong burger. So I, I don't I, I assume you either lose five for dropping it in the wrong chute. I'll look like next time you screw up a burger and drop it in the wrong chute. <laughs> okay. Because it might only be five, in which case that's better. But it Yeah, I think it's you lose five if you destroy it or drop it in the wrong chute, and you lose ten if it falls off the belt. But like time lettuce. Cheese and a lettuce. Or an onion. Or an onion. <laughs> Too late. Cheese. Just pick up anything at this point. Oh, I could do that. Yeah. I can't do that. It, yeah. Ah, too 18. many mistakes there. It's so hard. But it's not... I think the burgers are moving faster. But they're not getting super complex. I'm try. 18995. Frankenstein's monster is only 4K? You're joking. There's no way Frankenstein's monster is 4K. I'm gonna run that right now. That's a very complex game with two screens, too. There's no way. Somebody's doing some crazy magic at Frankenstein's monsters. It is 4K. That's incredible. That's probably the winner. Wow. Somebody works some magic for Frankenstein's monster. What do you think, Camp Classic? I think that's the winner for sure. Okay. 
Okay, I can't play this. This is terrible. No, no, I mean, like, it's... Can you get me a better joystick? Yep, this one's good. Um, you don't need the button. Well, you do need the button, but it's not like a firing game. Oh, God. You want to start over? Yes, please. This is really annoying. Getting, all, getting rage reset -y. Yeah. Need more wine? No. <laughs> Just finding the joystick very un annoying to use. See a pack rat. Yeah, next Hi. Friday is John Champo's big uh, show, which I forgot to announce at the top of this. Oh my gosh. I could never get. Yeah, there we go. Um, I'm going to put that in the Atari Age forums on its its own announcement um, so people know about it, I think, because that's pretty big. Oh, Flackets has to go too. What time is it? Oh, it's 8.55. Yeah, it's not too reasonably... bad. Oh. I think it's you. No, it is me. I'm no. not. I'm not. You kind of have to be above it. Blue. Yeah, I think Frankenstein's, mo Frankenstein's monster is definitely a winner for 4K. Let's, let's see what other games are 4K. What is? Uh, there is a nice list of. Atari 2600 um, games with sizes, ROM sizes. You're probably on that page right now. Four K, eight K ROM. Roms? No, that's not good. Most of Magic games appear to be 4K too. Really? Wow. Uh, Cosmic Arc's pretty impressive, but it doesn't have as many things going on as Frankenstein's monster, that's for sure. Where's that list? Ah, bank switching methods. Oh, I think I found the list. There it is. Size two. I'll just highlight everything that's four. Oh, it's just huge. Of course it's a huge, huge list. Oh, these are in order of release. Okay, so some of the older, the newer ones would be the more impressive ones. Yeah, Cubert's way late on the list. Frogger's Frogger's pretty pretty impressive. Venture's pretty impressive. Some of these are some of these on the list are unreleased. Uh, let's see, Activision. I mean, Pitfall's pretty damn good. Between Pitfall and Frankenstein's monster, Pitfall's more refined looking. It's a lot cleaner. Hmm. And it does have a lot of different uh, enemies and uh, things that you collect. It also has the vines, the logs, the pits, the alligators, um, the scorpions. Only 42,000 points away, Cafe Man 2D says. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, that's the page I'm on, Captain Classic. Uh, I'd say Pitfall's a winner so far for graphics. Keystone Capers. That's also 4K. That's really impressive. It's got... It's got the roof line, it's got escalators, a lot of, it's got two characters, animated characters. Ooh, that's a toss up. That is a toss up. Let's see. Oh, 
what happened there? I lost it. Oh. Frankenstein mo monster does animate that huge sprite. Oh, that is true. When you die, it like comes at you full screen. Ooh, it does get a bunch of bonus points for that. So, so I'd, I'd say it's a fairly close between Pitfall, Keystone Capers, and Frankenstein's monster for the most visually impressive 4K mm. game. Those are all really, really good. Six thousand points! Mm. Oh, smash your face! <laughs> Big burger. I don't think there's any been a burger yet in the games I played that everything went on it. You can mm -hmm. see some graphical glitches that are coming through because of my system. Because the RGB board. Once in a while there's little flashes on the conveyor belt. Oh, waiting for the cheese. That one needs an onion. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm just gonna let that go off. Mm -mm. Oh, is that right? It oh, is. it is. It oh. is. Whew. Cheese and lettuce. What is that? Oh, that's for this. You can one. do an empty. <gasps> yeah. Oh, my oh. goodness, that's oh, it tricky. Tr it tricks you yeah. because it's an empty burger. Cheese. Well, it doesn't trick you. It's doing oh, it on purpose. No, that's not Bye good. Bye, burger. Good show, guys. Oh, no. Gonna go now. Thanks, oh, Dan. Oh no! Nothing needs an onion. Nothing needs that. Oh no! Throw it on that. No. Onion and lettuce. That's what I need. Oh, it's ready then. That's good. Uh, maybe the next one will need uh, a tomato. Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And a cheese for that one. Yeah. I need an onion and a lettuce. And cheese. Top bun, quick. Oh, green. Well, that's funny. The cheese is thinner. What do I need onions. on the onion? Uh, you need a lettuce or cheese. Or, sorry, a lettuce or... Yeah, lettuce or cheese. Oh. Yep, you onion. need that. Oh, I didn't... Don't pick. need that. No? No. Oh. Let, put it on that one going off. Okay. Yeah, you need an onion. And a cheese or a nothing. Yeah. What? Yep, a nothing? that one's good. Okay, blue. Spreadsheet reading on the fly. This is it's, ridiculous. Yeah. Oh, to, come on. It's okay, like a, everything needs that. More like a pattern recognition thing. And the last burger. Yeah, I got. I missed 7, two. Yeah. Could be worse. Could yeah, be worse. Still have time left. Yeah, ABC's going. <laughs> uh huh. Because they know we're not even remotely close <laughs> to this game. Would I get 17? Ugh. Almost rough. Almost halfway. Not even. Forty percent. Oh Whoa. come on! There uh, we go. Oh, it carries over your time from level to level. No. Well, That's your performance score. Oh, so that can stay if you don't mess up. Mm, I'll take empty burgers. Oh, so there's no time limit. It's just the conveyor belt. Oh, I thought that was a timer. Oh, Cafe Man. Midnight here. Good night, all. Thanks for the show. Yeah. That is one of the uh, unfortunate side effects of being on the West Coast. Mm -hmm. Is that everybody else is going to bed <laughs> when you're still up. And also for buying things or meetings in the morning. Is that right? It's nothing. It's a nothing. Oh, no. Just throw it away. Got one performance. Oh no! Smashed on your head. You lose one for each one you smash. So your performance scores. That's the, probably the best score I've had. It's almost 9705. Yeah. Yeah. I'll do one more. Let's see how I yeah? go. Yeah. You're not gonna keep going to 45. Uh, unless it's I do so really, hard. really well this, this time. This game, playing this game, makes me really want a burger. <laughs> 50 you don't gain like you have 50 for the whole game right uh, you don't get it back do you? i don't think you do but i did read oh that this out. joystick is not as good i like it better no, it sucks i don't like the 
strong. Um, you can add or lose performance points depending on your efficiency. Oh, you can add it. So every time you hit 10, hit 10,000 points, so I was very close, uh, you get 10 performance points. 10. So you, you only get it when you hit 10,000. That is very far so and few between. So you have to get there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that's the only way you get the back. So every 10,000 points, you get it. 10. This is a longer throw. I kind of like it. Yeah? Yeah. More it's, control? Eh, it's just different. Mm. Not more control. Just... That is a much shorter throw. I like the clickiness, too. Well, that mm -hmm. one is pretty clicky. That's clicky. I too. like it, but it's uncomfortable on my lap. That that joystick, unfortunately. I know. That's it's what gets big. me... I need, I need a, we need to buy me off Amazon or something, a little um, tray, TV Not tray. A tray. TV tray? Not no. a TV tray. But no, one that upstairs. sits up so that oh. you have a surface to work on. Yeah, we That would actually that. make it a lot easier to play, I think. Is that your wine? That smells like uh, nail polish. It's so it's, strong. It's not that strong. <laughs> it is it just wine. It smells like nail polish. I did wave it in your direction, though. I Ugh. don't usually do that, so. Almost giving me a headache. Oh, poor thing. <laughs> it is. It's so strong. No cheese. No cheese. No tomato. No tomatoes here. Yes, I need that. I need that. Cheese and onion burger does sound yummy. <laughs> I need that by itself. It's like a grilled cheese with onions. It's very, very tasty. Mm. Which makes me want a grilled cheese now. I am so suggestible. <laughs> you um, did have dinner, right? You I did have dinner. dinner. We had a, we had wonderful Indian food. So, yes. um, it was very good. The it pakoras was, were very good. The pakoras were excellent. Yeah. Yeah. I think we'll be ordering um, from them again. Yeah, I think so. Did we have Indian food from them? We ate Once. their pizza, and that wasn't great. I. It was not great. Pizza and Indian, like you're just <laughs> co trying to cover off too much there, yeah. I think. And we did uh, have the Indian, Indian food w is excellent there, so yeah. I think it was fine last time, but I think they've gotten better. Like it was much yeah, better this time. Yeah, I wasn't impressed time. the last time, yeah. and this this was very tasty. It was adequate. It was much time. better. It was yeah. much better this time, so they've improved. I need an onion Improves with that. Not a cheese at all. An onion. Tandoori chicken pizza isn't bad. I like tandoori chicken. I, I would tandoori guess that would be pretty yeah, that'd tasty. Yeah, that would probably be pretty good. Yeah, that would be pretty tasty. Green. They had a very good butter chicken sauce. They did. It was The sauce was really good. The sauce was excellent. With an onion. I don't need a lettuce. Ah! I know. That's how you lose a performance point. If you go right up to the bin spitting things out, you can send them back really quick. What? No. Oh my god. I mean, no, that's, that's... It was nothing. It was nothing. It's you've... Isn't that onion and... I'm confused. One of them was nothing. It oh. just gave me a... Yeah, you want that and onion. Not that. Onion it up. I'm being very strange. <laughs> <laughs> And a blue. Uh, <laughs> uh, I need an onion and a nothing. And a nothing. A top. A top. And I need a lettuce. And then and a, a cheese. cheese. And a top. this wasn't like sponsored by McDonald's back in the day yeah well, I guess Activision didn't uh, look for a sponsorship for it Lettuce. Um, or maybe video games it was a little too early probably I don't know uh, they I don't know started the coming in the 80s were. yeah not that and an onion right onion and then another lettuce and onion can you imagine what a horrible job this would be if it actually existed in Doing real life Oh, I missed one. Mm. It would be 
a pretty t well people do this similar thing they yeah, look at orders and they have to put it condiments on. flying at you all day long <laughs> i guess your terrible. day would go by quickly <laughs> really quick that's for sure so tomato the to fastest work day i've ever worked was working at a gift shop at christmas time Not nope that. and uh Onion, yes. working the cash Oh, yeah. And I would work 12 hour shifts and they would be over before I could blink. Yeah, like, onion. it was crazy. Yeah, anything that's non stop. Oh, and it was just continuous. There was continuous line of people. Lettuce, snow cheese, and the lettuce. Surprisingly, I did not find people rude. Like, they were a little tired. <laughs> I found people tired. Lettuce and tomato, oh, yeah. no cheese. Oh, yeah. Tired. They just want to go yeah, home. Yeah, like I didn't find people particularly rude. Just that they were tired and they wanted to get their their stuff bought. Onion. And they're the top. top. Blue. Um. Uh, lettuce by itself. Get. An onion with nothing, or it'll give me a top. So that's kind of nice to know that predictability. So far, it has done that. Every time that there's an opportunity for a top, it's like, you've completed a burger, here's a top. Yeah, it, and if you miss the top, you're like, damn, you really throw you're in off. Trouble. Nope. Uh, yes. Yep. Yeah, if you miss the top, you're done. You're going to have to throw away some burgers or something. And a cheese. I think in the earlier levels, it gives you more of what you need. And maybe on the later levels, it doesn't give you as much mm -hmm. what you need. You have to reject more. And a lettuce. Well, don't need you. Need you. Get in the hang of it. Yeah. I found the last round I was getting much better, so... We've got more if I didn't miss that one on the first level. Mm. Yay, I'm above what I started with. Yeah, that's good. You could get up to 99 performance points, they said. You 99. can't exceed 99. You'd have to get a oh, lot. Oh, it is moving faster. It is. It does every 10,000 points, I think. Oh. I, th I assume. I or at least at the 10,000. Yes. And tomato it up. Yeah, it's moving faster. This is where it gets harder. You yep. a cheese and everything. And lettuce, lettuce and a tomato, tomato and an onion. Oh. Do I need that? I guess. No. Oh, wrong one. No. Need a lettuce and a tomato. And an no. onion. I'll do an onion. And a tomato. And a cheese. And no. Oh, you know what? You can have a plain one. You can have a plain right. one. Right. Yeah. So it'll give me that again. Yeah. Uh, tomato, tomato and oh, for the plain one. Right. I might as well. You might as well get it out because it'll keep coming up every time a plain one comes down. And that right. kind of messes you up. Uh, lettuce and tomato, yep. Forgot for a second. Oh, sec. I know. I know when you come back in, you're like, what's going on? <laughs> what is happening? And a top, yep. Green. Ugh, I miss some. Lost some points. Tomato and a, nothing. And a top. Yeah, everyone's gone to sleep. <laughs> yes. Like enough of this like, game. Oh, he's going for another high score. So either a tomato or an onion. Thank you. I'm trying to get my brain on it. A lettuce and, and an onion. onion. And then a topping. Yeah. Might as well get the easy ones done. A and cheese, cheese and an, and an onion. onion. Nope. 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 Lettuce yep. and itself. Yeah. Lettuce. Lettuce. Oh, two more burgers. And, and an onion and tomato. Onion and tomato, yeah. Nope. <laughs> nope. And the top. And into the bread. Nope, that's it. Oh! It does show your extra one that you haven't done yeah so it's kind of misleading when you've 
messed one up. Okay. Oh, easy ones. Oh, it's fast. It's faster, but easier. Is it? Easier burgers to make, but it's faster. I did make it to this level last time. To single toppings, but mm -hmm. blue faster. An onion. And as long as you keep ahead of it. Blue. Oh, nope. Yes. And blue. Uh, yep. And top for green. Nope. Lettuces. And top for green. Which one will pick the mo the bottom one first? It picks in your list. Yeah, for the most part. So for you can kind of predict kind which of. color it's going to need to yep. go into. And then green. Yeah, unfortunately, it's not RGB. Yes. That is unfortunate. Yeah. And red. Obviously, everything's red from now on. Nope. Nope. Lettuces, Lettuce. please. Nope. Lettuce. There we go. That's an easy round. It's like a break almost. Yeah. Ooh. New high score for oh, me. Oh, that's New good. New personal best. And you'll get another 10 yeah. performance oh, points. Even more than before. Yeah. Wow. Almost halfway there. <laughs> I think now we're doing better than last time. Harder. I don't know. Yep. And a plane and a top for that. Oh, no. Kick it off. There you go. Oh, it's not giving oh, the tops it's anymore. It's being nice. It's green. Oh, no. Keep going. Kick it. It's not and being nice top anymore. For green. Yes. yes. And a lettuce, lettuce. And a top for blue. Yes. And yes. And, and a top, top for green. Yes. yes. And a cheese. Nope. There you go. And a top for green. Yep. Yes. And, and an onion. onion. And a top for red. Yes. yes, and, and a a cheese. cheese. Oh boy. Red. Uh, mm. Yes, on its own. Good. For the top. <laughs> That's a fast one to make. Blue. Yes, yes, on its and own. Yeah. For green. Nope. Nope. Do I need, nope. nope. I need lettuces yes. and cheese. Cheese and lettuce. Oh no. Oh, you have a cheese alone. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Nope. Yes. And a, a cheese. cheese. And a top. Yep. Nope. Yes. Yes. And a cheese. Nope. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh no! Hopefully another comes out. Get it! There you go. And that's red. We only lost one, so that's not really. Bad. I kicked. I destroyed a couple. You you destroyed toppings, but not. I was at fifty six, and now yeah. I ended up at forty eight at the end. I mm. lost quite a bit there. Mm. Cause I think I dropped a burger somewhere. Next one is over halfway. Be challenging. It's going to be three now. This is going to yeah. be hard. And fast. If you get through this, you'll get to single ones again. Yeah. Yes. Oops. Oh, yeah. That, and an onion, and a top. For red. Nope. nope. Yes, and an onion, and a top for green. And yes, yep. and nope. And, an and onion. Sure. well, you lose one, but yeah, there you go. You don't lose points green. for doing that. One. You lose a point for one, doing that. One, just one. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, uh, what am I doing? Yeah. No. Uh. Onion. Onion. Yep. And a cheese. And a cheese? I don't know. I can't even tell anymore. 
There we go. They're red. Onion. And a lettuce. And a tomato. Oh no! No, it's uh, dead. Onion. Put it on the next one. And, and a cheese. cheese. Yeah, and a top for green. This one is gonna be hard. Onion. And, and a cheese. cheese and a top for green. Lettuce, lettuce. And a tomato and an onion. Or in a top. Yeah, that oh. works too. For okay. bread. Sorry. Onion. Onion. Oh, oh lettuce. lettuce. And a, a cheese. cheese and a tomato. You need a tomato. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this work on the next one. Okay, lettuce and no tomato. Nope. Uh, tomato and, an, and onion. an onion and a top. Oh my gosh, for red. <sighs> Everything else is blue now. So cheese and a top. Oh, for blue. That's okay. Oh, that was that was a hard round. That's a hard round. Thirty thousand. It isn't being nice anymore. Yes. <laughs> but the end is visible now. The light at the end of the tunnel is visible. This is even I'm at, worse. I'm at, <gasps> I'm at 32. Oh no. Okay. You need a lettuce, lettuce or an onion. Onion works. A lettuce, fine. Do the lettuce. Okay. Whatever works. Red. Okay. No nope. Lettuce. Uh, top. Yes. Yeah, let me catch up. It's a green. Bit. Uh, yes. And you need onion and tomato. Nope. Oh, onion. why is it kicking? That's okay. There you go. And then green. Uh, yes. Oh, it's full. You need everything. Lettuce, tomato, and an onion. Yep. And a top. And that's right. That should get more points for that. You do, actually. What? No. Okay, oh, so it's get not, that, get that. It's not yeah, kicking. and a top. That's okay. It's not kicking. It's only one, so it's not the end of the world. Uh, onion and tomato for everything. Nope. There you go. And there you go. Red. Uh, n yes. Yes, by itself. Actually, yep. that's a good one. Blue. Onion. And, and lettuce. lettuce yep, and, and tomato. tomato. Nope. Uh, nope. Yeah. Okay, blue. Uh, nope. nope. Onion and tomato for everything. Nope. Nope. Come on. Nope. No. Oh my gosh, it's being so mean. Get it. Oh no. Uh, oh, just. Yeah. I have to. Oh. That was mean. It was terrible. That was really mean, Blue. And tomato. And onion. 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 Somewhere. Onion. There you go. I should make this. And yeah. then red. Oh, you're not dead yet, but... Oh, oh, my God. That is rough, man. 36. That's really good. Oh, Oh, they're finally. singles. They're faster, but they're singles. That's fine. It's so much easier. Do not so make any easier. mistakes. Nope. Yes. And the top for blue. Oops. If you can survive this round, you'll get more performance points. Nope. <laughs> and the, that. And the oh, top. That's true, right? For green. Uh, yes. And a top for green. I, I don't know if I'm helping you at all. Yeah, you are. Onion and a top for green. Uh, tomato and a top for blue. Lettuce and a top for green. Nope. <laughs> nope. Onion <laughs> nope. and a top for red. Nope. Uh, nope. Lettuce and a top for red. Yes, and a top for red. <gasps> nope. Onion and a top. Just onions. For blue. Uh, nope. nope. Onions or... Nope. Just onions. Nope, just onions. Come on. Onion and a top for blue. Last one, onion. And Yay, top just in time. For red. Perfect round. Oh, I oh. don't get 10,000 more. I know, I want a burger too. 
You, my God. Oh my God, three more thousand. Okay. Two and a half thousand. <sighs> Just two toppings. Okay. No lettuce. <laughs> onion. Yeah. And a tomato. Oh, and a <gasps> tomato. Oh, an onion. Uh, nope. Onion and a cheese. Yeah. And a top for blue. Uh, yes. Lettuce. And a lettuce. And a top, please, please, please. For red. Uh, nope. Uh, top for green. Or blue. Blue, 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 blue. Sorry. Yes. And a top for green. Uh, onion and a... Ooh, oh. Tomato. I'm gonna just skip that one because it's too hard. Uh, tomato for yeah. green. Onion. And nope. Uh, nope. Uh, let, yes. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh no. There's no bonus. It was so close. You did really, really well though. This is That's way better picture. than you've ever done. Oh yeah. I've never way done this close. better than you've ever done. Uh, <gasps> I could do it again. It was hard. That level was friggin' hard. It was super fast. I should continue because if I start doing this again on another day, I would start way back. Do it one more time. Do it one more time. It's so long to get to that point too. How long was that? That was long. 20 minutes. It's 926. Nice. Easily 20 minutes. Yeah. But I can do better by just not like doing that. <laughs> um, by making perfect, like not missing things. Like last round, I did miss some burgers. Not yeah, too many. Yeah, you did. You did very well. I think missing the odd I bird think some burger early, is fine. Is fine. I think some early ones I, I missed, and it's just no excuse. Mm, I don't think you did that badly. I think you actually did extremely. No, don't. We're, we're, you're never gonna, you're never gonna play the game if, <laughs> if, if you lose one point and you stop. Yeah. Okay. You have to commit to it. You need to memorize GRB. Yeah, that is true. GRB. GRB. It's little runny legs at the top. Run, 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 oh, run, 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 run. His little boots. He's like little, he's like an Atari running up and down <laughs> the stairs. GRB. GRB. Bounce, 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 bounce. <laughs> bounce, 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 bounce. <laughs> Red. No cheese. No lettuce. Plano burger. Painfully slow the first level when you've been up that high. Yeah, you can be quite high on the the um, topping and kick it. Mm-hmm. It, you ha you want to be above it almost yeah. because if you're too low then it smooshes on your face or I don't know what it's hitting but it, that's when it it fails. Yeah, so being quite a bit above it is mm -hmm. is better than being below being it. Being below it. Do your points increase as the levels go I off? think they must. Because that's only 2,000. Or no. That's only 100, but I think it's more as the levels get harder. It is, for sure. So I got 3,000 there. No. I... No. It goes up a bit. It goes up a bit. The bonus yeah. you get Not goes much, up. Not much, but a little bit. Yeah. Because that was 3,000. 
the bonus goes up. Just by itself. Green. Oof. Ooh, that was close. Tomato itself. Onion by itself. No, not by itself. Cheese. Or with tomato. Tomato yep. and cheese. cheese. Uh, and cheese. Yeah. <gasps> oh no. What? You can put it on the top. You only lose one point for that. Cheese, right? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Why did that kick? Why did that happen? No. Onion and cheese for blue. Tomato and lettuce. lettuce. And lettuce onion. or onion. Lettuce and cheese. Lettuce and onion. Yeah. Cheese and lettuce. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Too low. You can be. There is a sweet spot. You, there is a. You can be too high. And I've been doing oh. that twice. Because it's yeah. like, oh, you can't be too high. Well, no, you, 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 can you can. You can't kick ingredients whenever it hits a chef sprite. It is only catching that is picky. Oh, you can't. Can't, can't you, you kick, kick ingredients? You can. You can kick anywhere, mm. I believe. But you can't catch it anywhere. No. Or maybe you can't kick it anywhere. Nope. It's not giving me tops right away. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Onion. onion. Yep. And by itself. Yeah, by itself, or with, or it. with an onion, or with a lettuce and tomato. Beginning is painfully Green. slow. It is after you're a pie. Yes, and a lettuce and a cheese. Green. With a cheese or a lettuce. No. Nope. nope. Just lettuces and hello, Tari. Hi. To the red. Nope. Uh, nope. Uh, onion and lettuce yes. and possibly cheese. Red. Cheese and lettuce and onion. Hi, baby. Nope. Oh. That's for the top one. Are you gonna make me crazy, Atari? Nope. What do I need? Cheese, lettuce, uh, onion. Yeah. No, what do I need left? Onion, onion. Oh, I don't know. Oh, Oof. red. Cheese and tomato. Lettuce can go in the top okay. or this one. Atari, fine. settle. Tomato. Please. Blue. And lettuce and onion. Tari. Blue. Please settle. Sit down. Sit down, baby. Sit down. Yeah. Needs a speed up button. Yeah. 
so you can speed up the conveyor belt. Yeah. I thought you were talking about Atari. <laughs> the cat speed up button. Yeah. Settle down. <laughs> speed up. Settle down. And settled. Yeah. So that's better because I've gotten every burger so far. I haven't destroyed a burger. Yeah. Now you've said that you're going to do that. Of okay. Of course. So, onion and cheese you need. Need an onion. Need an onion. Need an onion. Come on. Get with the program. There we go. Blue. Lettuce, onion, cheese. Sorry. Need the cheese. There you go. Bread. Onion and a topping. Oh, good. Need some speed Into up the ones. red. Uh, no cheese. Ugh. Oh, no. Onion and tomato. Thank you. Green. Lettuce and tomato. Or cheese. Yeah. Ugh. It's okay. Go for the... Or cheese and what? An onion. All of it. Tomato. Oh. And what? Uh, tomato. Oh my goodness. I have to get there you go. <gasps> no. Oh no! And now I have to get rid of that. And I have to get rid of that. My god. Cheese. Everything. Onion. Tomato. tomato. And then like lettuce. Wrecked it. Wrecked a burger! Blue. And lettuce. And? Lettuce and <laughs> cheese or tomato. Sorry. Uh, Even I'm having trouble figuring uh, it out. <laughs> Red. Help. Uh, no onions. Uh, top, yes. For uh. blue. Uh, lettuce and cheese. Here you go. This That's time. okay, red. Tomato, plain. And the green. Um, no onions. Kitten. Lettuce. Thanks the cat. Yeah, Kitten. I think so. Tomato, yes. He's and really, cheese. You need cheese. It's really on me. And a top. Blue. Okay, he's got to go. He's like licking my hand and nudging me. It's being very nice, but not right now. Catnip is the cat's meat up <laughs> Yeah. That is true. I don't even notice there's one pixel flickering on the gray conveyor, but I've noticed the the, the pixel. There's a couple it's, of pixels that It's flicker. my Atari. Is it? Yeah. It's the RGB mod. Mm. It It's Kay. flawed. Anything. There you go. Uh, nope. You need top. Ooh, that's mean. Into the green. Onion. And the top. The RGB creates... Into the um, green. Up. Uh, Playfield nope. delay. Lettuce and a top. Or delays. Blue. Nope. Just All tomatoes. tomatoes. Red. Yep. And a top into the red. Yep. Into the green. Nope. No. Nope. Red. Yes. Into the red. Yes. <laughs> no, we did not get catnip flavor joysticks this year. Oh, that would How... that, that would be a problem. Yeah, into the green. That doesn't sound like a very good gift. <laughs> <laughs> They'd be chewing on them. They'd be yeah. bugging you when you're playing. Nope. Onions only. To the blue. Nope. Nope. Onions only. Into the red. Uh, I'm not doing this well. I'm doing fine. Yeah, you're going to get more. Maybe say left, center, right. Uh, I think at this point that might get too confusing. Yeah. It's going to be a plain one. Oh, Maybe. I hope so. Nope, nope. lettuce and onion. Nope. Nope. 
Nope. Nope. Top. Oh, to the top one. I almost put it on that I one. I know. Green. Onion, yes. And top. Perfect. Into the green. Uh, nope. Uh, top into the green. Oh, good. Speed up time. Uh, yes. And, and uh, onion, onion or tomato. Yeah, tomato. And now we go into blue. Uh, onion and lettuce or cheese. Into the blue. Cheese by itself. Yes, by itself. Into the red. Uh, cheese, cheese and, and onion. onion. Uh, top for the top one. Into the red. And, and onion. Yep. Yeah. Into the green. Uh, onion and lettuce. Nope. Nope. Yeah, there you go. And that's into the red. Uh, nope. Uh, top into the red. Lettuce, cheese, and the top into the blue. And onion. Oh no, lettuce, onion, so ugh, it's going to be bad. Yeah. And a top into the blue. Whew. Yay. Feeling bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, onion and a top if they give it to you. Or tomato. Why waste it? Into the green. No lettuce. A top into the blue. Nice when they give that to you once in a while. Uh, cheese. And you need an tomato onion. and onion. Yeah. Green. Cheese Sweet. and onion. Nope. Come on. <gasps> oh no. What? Onion and a top. Put the bottom one into the red. Uh, nope. Oh, yeah, you could. Yeah. On yeah. the bottom one? Nope, 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 middle. And the top and the bottom one. Bottom one, bottom one, that into one? the green. Oh, yeah. okay. Uh, cheese, yes, and you need lettuce on the bottom one. And lettuce? Yes. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, that was lucky. Blue. Uh, cheese and tomato. No, I don't think you're going to get it. Tomato. Oh, no. Oh, no. Now I have to throw a Bloody yeah. burger away. Yeah. That and a top into the blue. It happens. It's hard. Nope. Oh. Ugh. Drop it. Okay, so onion on the top and the top on the top into the green. Uh, that cheese. cheese and tomato and a top into the red. Mm. Oh, you got ten more, though. Thank God. Yeah. That is helping. Is it an easy level again? I think it is. Nope. No, it's terrible. One level. more terrible level to go. <laughs> yeah. That. And onion. And lettuce. And a cheese. Oh, that too. That works. Yeah? Into the blue. Okay. Uh, tomato and lettuce, or cheese and onion and lettuce. Oh, nope, top. There you go, in the red. Uh, onion and lettuce. Oh, in the top. Top. Uh, yeah, it's going to fuck you over. That's okay. Into the blue. It's probably too late anyway. Yeah. Oh, cheese. You need everything. Cheese. cheese. Lettuce. Lettuce. Nope, that's okay. Tomato. Onion. You need an onion still. There you go. And that goes into the green. Onion. Oh, lettuce. lettuce. Uh, nope. nope. And tomato. Oh, onion. Yep. And tomato. Red. Uh, cheese by cheese itself. Cheese by itself. Into the green. Lettuce. 
tomato or no tomato yep into the green uh, onion oh lettuce and tomato good and top into the red uh, tomato mm -hmm. onion onion and a top into the red uh, lettuce no, no. Ooh, onion <laughs> Uh, nope. Tomato. And a top. Ooh, into the blue. And onion and tomato. Ooh. Ooh, into the green. Oh. Don't have as many points. And I won't make the 40. Oh, ah, but it's an easy level. You I might think. make a 40 in this level. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Nope. Yes. Into the red. Whew. And tomato. And a top. Into the blue. A lettuce. And a top. Into the green. Mm. Onion, onion. And a top. Into the blue. Nope. And a top into the red. Nope. A top into the green. Nope. Onion and a top into the blue. Nope. Yes. And a top into the red. Yes. And a top into the green. Barely keep up at this speed. Onion and a top. With one topping. Into the That's red. That's crazy. Nope. Lettuce. Nope. Uh, nope. Yes. And a top into the blue. Onion. A top. Into the green. Now it's time for pain. Oh, you get ten more. Yeah, the next one is pain. Deep breaths. If I complete the next one... You've already beat your last score. I did. If you I complete the next thousand. one, I can do it. All I have to do is beat this one. Mm. It's hard. It's fast. Okay, cheese and lettuce, yes. Needs and a top heart. into the blue. Green. Oh my god. Onion <laughs> and cheese and a top into the green. Paying attention now. Tomato... And a top into the green. Lettuce. Oh, oh no. Cheese geez. and an onion. And a top into the blue. Onion, onion and tomato. And a top into the green. Lettuce. Uh, nope. And tomato. Or cheese, actually. Oh. Into the blue. Uh, lettuce. And a top. Oh, no, in the bottom. Oh, no. God damn it. Oh, no. Cheese and a lettuce. Or a top to the top one. Into the blue. Oh, onion. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh! no. <laughs> no. What the hell? <laughs> oh, no. You gave me bad instructions. I'm sorry. Oh no! Like one burger away. Oh no! Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh shit! Oh. oh, that's pain. Oh. Well, we know S. Ramirez has been is has been lurking. <laughs> yes. He has been. So close. Oh, that's pain. Well, are you going to go for another round? <laughs> yes. I am. Does it have a demo mode or you just stand there? It just stands there. Oh, well, maybe. <laughs> oh, it does have a demo mode. Oh, my goodness. Look, it plays better oh, than me. Oh, so close. Look, you can actually play. Wow. In the demo mode? Yeah. Oh. You actually... 
He actually knows what he's doing. This game is brutal. Yes. It... Like, I could have done that level, but... It's hard. Somebody I, gave me bad instructions. It's really hard. It is. It's hard to even keep track of what's going on at the bottom. Have you not com uh, got the patch, S. Ramirez, oh, in this yes, game? I, oh, I 100%. Bet. He's just saying, in general, this game is brutal, is I'm brutal. sure. The demo shows bad strategy. Oops. Don't do the demo. Don't do what the demo does. Yeah. <laughs> I was messing up a lot more last game because I was I came into the end with a lot less I bet if numbers. you do it perfectly, you hit 4,500 by the time you hit that round. So you don't have yep. to do it. But you'd have to do it perfect. Yep. I bet. Yeah. Every level. Up into every that. Every burger. Yeah. There's a switch to turn off the music, but it's so quiet. You don't need yeah, to. Yeah, it's not that obtrusive. I've come so close. Both times. <laughs> Within a thousand points. You were 140 points away last yeah, that's, time. That's, that's embarrassing. Well, it's not embarrassing. It's just it's a brutal game. It is. At that at that level it's moving so fast you cannot play it. Like it feels like you can't play it without letting something fall off, right? I'm gonna give Gary Kitchen It's a great game. Night, next time I talk to him. Yeah. Gary, why'd you make this game so hard? <laughs> or put the patch so high. Yeah. He probably didn't have anything to do with the patch level. No. So it was like, oh, okay, well what do you think? They probably just did. go, oh this is it's hard to get to it's hard to get to this level, so Now Jeez. I need some direction. Yeah. Into the blue. Cheese and onion. Just cheese and onions. No lettuce. No cheese again. No. Not yet. Now I need cheese. Into the blue. No lettuce, cheese, and tomato or onion. Into the blue. Cheese, Cheese and, and still tomato or onion. Yeah. Onion and top into the green. Lettuce, Lettuce and, and cheese. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. Reminds me of Overcooked, except single player. Agreed. Yep. This is the original of Onion all those cooking and games. And a top for into the pit. Overcooked is a pretty fun game. Nope. Bond a whole genre of games. And onion is what you want. Tomato and onion. Come on. Sometimes it doesn't do that a lot. Sometimes it's like, yeah, we're going to give you tons of garbage. Yeah. Onion and cheese. Into the blue. Cheese and, and onion or lettuce. Into the green. Tomato, by, Tomato itself. by itself. Red. Nope. nope. Lettuce, lettuce and, and cheese. cheese. I still can't get the crackpots. I haven't got crackpots either. That is even harder, I think, than this. Dan Heck for crackpots, too. Yeah. Dan! 
You and your brother, stop making hard games back in the 80s. <laughs> but they're both amazing, amazing games. Mm -hmm. Okay, tomato. And a top itself. into the blue. Nope. Onion and tomato. What is it, Santa? I will tell you in a moment. Oh. oh, see, you shouldn't be checking that at all. I'm sorry. I know. Don't even look over. <laughs> Cheese and nothing. Cheese and lettuce. No nope. cheese. Tomato, tomato by, by itself. itself. Yeah. Red. Yes, so, by itself or, or with, with an onion. onion. You have just Green. enough time to get to the bottom. Cheese and tomato. Lettuce and onion. Red. Tomato by itself. Tomato. Sorry. Uh, tomato with mm. cheese in the blue. Onion by itself into the red. That's an easy one. <laughs> yeah. And again. Nope. Nope. Give me the onion. Onion by itself into the red. So far, perfect burgers. Good. Keep on that track. Extra points. Yay. 59. Better than before. Yep. Better than ever. You get bonuses for your performance score too. Performance score? Yes. It it goes down and oh, you get bonus you get for bonus. it. Yes. Yeah. So the higher your performance so score, the, the higher the faster you get. So cheese. Oh, that's okay. Tomato. And onion with a top. Oh, and uh, cheese. What? Yeah. Yeah. And cheese. Yeah. My god, it's so hard when there's three. Come on. Into the blue. You're not moving around. You can I eat know. It. Tomato, lettuce, and cheese. Lettuce, yeah, and cheese. And that is going the green. Cheese, uh, tomato, no. I need it faster. Tomato. And onion? Oh shit, I fucked that up. What is it? I'm so confused. Nothing? Cheese and onion. It's nothing. Uh, uh, lettuce and... Cheese. Put the onion, onion. below. Oh, no. oh god. Okay, what Lettuce, do I need? onion, and tomato. Yeah, there you go. Oh my god, I need Into the help. Green. I need it's help. Horrible. Okay, I've got a lettuce. lettuce what goes with lettuce? Cheese. cheese. There and we a go. Top. Into the blue. Because oh, I'm panicking. That was terrible. Lettuce. Cheese. cheese. Not a tomato. Yeah. Onion and a top. Into the green. Oh, I lost so many performance Sorry. points. Sorry. Cheese. Tomato. Mm. Nope. Nope. You need onion yeah, and I lettuce. Oh. lettuce. Lettuce and onion. Oh. There you go. And a top into the blue. Uh, n you don't need a tomato. What do I? Oh, I don't need a tomato at all. No. Okay. Oh God! Just put it on the tomato. Put it on the tomato. No. You said oh. it's better not to drop it down here. Yeah, it is better to drop it down there. Then let it go off the conveyor belt? Yes, yeah, so you get 10 if it goes off the conveyor belt and 5 if you drop it down. Okay, I need help. Yeah, lettuce. Onion. Onion and topping. Uh, Into the red. Tomato and lettuce. Into the red. Lettuce, onion, and cheese. Onion, and a top into the green. 
Terrible. Terrible round. You lost two. You lost track of what was I, happening. It was so... Because it, it was so complicated in the bottom. I was, like, trying to figure out what that stupid spreadsheet was saying. If I get a cheese, ignore everything but things with cheese. Okay. Look, it's an easy level again. But it's just so far away now. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, no. I don't need that. <laughs> Gar. Nope. <laughs> yep. What was that person saying? I don't know. You keep looking at it instead of playing the game, <laughs> so you're yet getting mad at me, and you're not paying attention to what you're playing. Well, that's an easy level again. One top level. Ah. So if you keep your performance level high, you get more points, mm -hmm. which gives you higher score. Higher score, which gives you more performance. So the more performance you have, the more performance you get. No, you don't get. No, you get a higher score. Yeah, which gives you. You need. Uh, you need an onion. Which gets you to a higher score, which gets you more performance at every Faster, ten thousand. Yes. Yeah. That and an onion. Green gets you to the performance faster. Yeah. yeah. You need a tomato. Blue. But of course that makes sense. Playing well gets you yeah. nope. more points. <laughs> nope. Nope. I need, oh nope. my god. Yeah, there you go. Cheese and a tomato. Is there like a point where it's like blue? Oh, I'm just not going to give you anything. You're Onion screwed. Onion and lettuce. You need lettuce, lettuce, and a topping, oh my and God. green. Nope. Yes, and a top. Oh, thank you. Red. Bit of a break. And cheese, and a top. Nope. Cheese, oh, tomato, yeah. And a top, there you go, into the green. And cheese. And that works in the blue. A little onion, yes, and a top. To the red. Everything's red. That and cheese. And a top into the red. And tomato and a top. Nope. No, not a top. Oh no! Not a top. I needed a oh! cheese. I missed that completely. Uh oh! Navigator's fired. I know. <laughs> Not great. Yeah. Actually, you only get 10 for your performance, so it's not... Is it 10? Yeah, 10 extra. It's not a ton. It helps. It helps, but it's not a it ton. It helps a lot. If you're at 99, yeah. <laughs> well, if you're at 99, you're not having any troubles. Because mm -hmm. you've already passed. Nope. I need a... Lettuce. lettuce. Cheese and lettuce. <laughs> Red. Cheese, Jeez. lettuce, and onion. Mm, uh, upper one is fine. Yeah, top for the upper one. Upper one. Green. Nope. Yeah, onion. Nope. nope. Lettuce. 
and then a top in the green. Cheese. Nope. Nope. Onion and lettuce and now a top into the red. Uh, tomato, onion, and lettuce. Oh. And a top into the green. Onion, lettuce. Oh, a uh, top. Oh, that's uh, awful. Nope. Yep. Oh. That one was gone. Yeah. Oh, that's Unfortunately. awful. Unfortunately. Yeah. Uh, tomato and onion. And blue. Lettuce nice. and cheese and onion. And top. Oh, not a good red. Round. Uh, you're gonna pass 30,000 I think though yeah. so you get your extra 10 which mm, is good a little bit it is because you get it at the end oh no I guess you don't but still oh it's tough it's a tough one it is mm. it's cheese lettuce need help. onion or tomato tomato works too yeah Red, onion, lettuce, and cheese. Red, cheese, onion, tomato. Green. Nope. Nope. Well, tell me what I do need. Lettuce, topping, yep. And blue. It's so hard. <laughs> Onion, Onion alone. Yeah. Blue in the green. Tomato and lettuce. I oh. needed that. No, just just go for tomato and lettuce. Or fine. Lettuce and onion. There you go. Green. Nope. Tomato and lettuce. In the green. Lettuce. Uh, yep, in red. <gasps> oh! Lettuce and a topping in red. <laughs> Cheese, uh, onion, and tomato. Oh my <gasps> god. Okay, uh, oh, yeah, there you go. For what? The bottom, the bottom, the bottom. Okay. Blue. I thought that one wasn't complete. Oh, <sighs> onion and topping. Oh, that was lucky. In yeah, blue. And tomato, lettuce, and uh, yeah, lettuce. And just the top, and the red. Not good, not terrible, oh, but not good. Oh, it could have been worse. Yeah. I only missed one, I guess. Technically, yeah. We'll do at least two more rounds. This is the easy yeah. round, though. Easy, then the one I always yeah. fail on. Yeah, the last one's really hard. Nope. Switch singles. Nope. Yes. Lettuce and topping. Yeah. And nothing. Blue. Uh, cheese. Oh, the cat's back. And Just in time. He needs to go. You can take Into the out. blue. No tomatoes. Lettuce and topping in green. Atari, how did you know to come in Onion right now? and topping in blue. Cheese and topping in green. No tomatoes. No lettuce. Cheese and <laughs> topping. I need to know what I need, not what I, I don't know. need. I know. It's just red. Onion and a lid in red. Onion and a lid in blue. Can you take them out and shut the door? <laughs> I can handle this level on my own. All right. I need to know what lettuce. I need, not what I don't lettuce need. Lettuce and top <laughs> in red. Oh, okay. We'll get at least another I 10. need to finish this next round to win. You have a, 
little I waste have skull. to. I, no, I don't. I need to finish this next round Look, to win. No, you don't. <gasps> oh my oh! god! Oh! How did I do so well? That's crazy. How you did didn't it do happen? as badly as you thought you did. Yeah. Because you. Uh, tomato. That's crazy. And top. In blue. Lettuce and onion. And top in blue. Tomato and cheese. Oh, no. Well, it's okay. Tomato and, and top. Top, top, top. No! What? The top <sighs> burger. Oh, cheese. And? Okay, put that to the top. Oh, tomato and tomato. Cheese and tomato. And the top in green. That's... Onion and lettuce. Oh, I'm... Oh. You have a free burger. Oh, well, I don't know that. Yes, you I do, because these. you're not looking at it. Cheese and tomato. And, and that can go burger. on the top. Yes, there we go. It, the top is a top of tomato. a burger. Tomato. Oh. Yeah, I should say upper burger. Yeah. Tomato and cheese. There you go. It's mm, okay. God. You've already passed it. It doesn't matter at this point. Red, lettuce, and tomato. You don't even care. I do. And top. I do care a lot. And red. <laughs> <laughs> Tomato and lettuce. Oh, okay. No, it's too far down. Yeah, maybe you're dead. Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> That's what we were going for. Uh, you made it in the last uh, round. That's the key. Making yep. it to that round because this Hooray, round is bloody patch. awful. Uh, Get the sash. I'll turn up the lights. Get the sash. Get the sash. Get the sash. It's right here. Well, I thought you said. For it. Get the I'll... sash. I'll turn out the lights. <laughs> He's, a <laughs> He's a little ornery. He's a little ornery right Rawr. now. Rawr. <laughs> I'll turn it on for you. Buttons hidden. It's not that hidden. There we go. There we go. Fast flashy. Is it <laughs> fixed? No, it's not fixed. Oh, that's... Hooray! Hooray! Do you have a Do you have a patch for it? No. No, it's expensive because it's it? a hard game. Yeah. <laughs> Hooray! Thank you, everybody, for staying with us. Oh, and some well, people I jumping in at the end. Played for four hours today. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that was a long day, but you were so close. It was totally worth it. <laughs> it was. That's You can't give up when you're that close unless you... I know. You're, unless you're getting worse, but I was getting yeah, better. You were getting better, so... Once you start getting worse, then you have to stop. Yeah. Because then it's And over. you thought you, would, you wouldn't even... Make it no, close. no, because this was so hard. We didn't even yeah. come close last time. But I think, I think we came to tw 20,000 last time. I think because it's... What do you need for the pressure cooker? Uh, 45. 45,000. So I just... Yeah. Just but that's managed. okay because twice he came this close. Yeah. So... Well, three times, I think. It's no, I think it was twice. Just twice? I think mm. the third time you got it. But the first time you didn't do that well. And then yeah. the net, then the next two, you came really Did, close. Yeah. And I think the key with this game is that it resets at a faster level, oh, yes. but it's easier. Yes. So as long as you can get to the easier level, you can get your score up. And those are around the 10,000 mark around. Yes. Yeah. So you get extra life. I just received an actual Sequest patch Ooh, in today's mail. Nice. I've, we haven't, we haven't played Sequest yet. No, we haven't. Oh no, we did. That's easy. That's an easy one. Is it? Yeah, I beat it in my first try. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. That's, That's one cool, of the though. easiest ones. Yeah. James, better than more than one third of the players in a high score club. Oh, yeah. Really? <laughs> really? High a score club is usually brutal scores. Better than a third of the players. Yeah. So two thirds of the players did even better. So. Oh, well, never mind that. Yeah. <laughs> so that, let's see how many patches I have now of actual Activision, old school patches. That makes patch number 21 out of 43 mm. of the original patches that exist. Mm. And two out of five of the homebrew. Mm. Yeah. Excellent. Good job. It's easy. It's not easy. No, no, no. Sequest. Oh, Sequest. Sequest. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I Sequest was, yeah. was so easy. Yeah. 
Like, it's one of the easiest. What's the next patch? Yeah. Well, I usually let the audience vote, and I give them three choices. Mm. Um, I crackpots is so hard. Um, the next one. I'm really not wanting to do decathlon because it's so long. Oh yeah. Like you have to play ten ga ten different types of events. Actually, oh, I see. Actually, it's not long. It's a long. The game. running one is long. The running one. Dolphin. I might go for dolphin. Yeah. Enduro is a long game. Dragster is very hard. Hmm. Um. What else? Oh no, Grand Prix. We didn't. We didn't get that one, didn't we? That's the one where you, we had the cars going in and out, weaving. The really big cars. Oh. Remember? And I you had to memorize a pattern. Yes. Yeah, the enduro was that Grand patch. Prix? That's not Dragster. That's Grand was, Prix. Yeah, Dragster is like, and it's oh, okay. five seconds long. Okay. The game's very fast. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, laser Blast is brutally boring and long to watch. Yeah. So I may do some of these on like a non day yeah like an extra day yeah because nobody wants to watch those for hours and hours uh maybe pitfall too yeah that's a fun game to watch that's ramirez gave up on crackpots and decathlon crackpots is hard, hard as hell yeah i didn't even come anywhere near close it gets yeah. so fast yeah um uh what else where's the oh plaque attack i haven't even tried that one you yeah, should give that a give that a go. Yeah. Um, where's the dolphin one? Dolphin. Enduro is fine, that's Ramirez says. Yeah, but it's long, isn't it? You have to go for five days. Roadbusters, five days. Mm. But maybe so it might be dolphin next. Mm. Um, maybe another crack at crackbots. Um, Heroes hard as hell. I got. I didn't even come really. I got about two thirds of a hero. Mm. It's hard. Then there's space shuttle, which is, you need an overlay for your, and you use all the switches and stuff oh, to do things. Oh, really? Oh, okay. So that's a complicated one. Yeah. Um, we did Star Master, but we got halfway in Star Master. I think that's possible because mm. I've got some hints from Thomas Yench. Mm. Yeah. I did have Dan send my c complete in box crackpots. Mm. Oh, very cool. Uh, there is a patch for Robot Tank. I have one out of three of the patches for Robot Tank. Oh. That's not too bad, that game, actually. Yeah. I may go for that one next, because I got pretty close for Robot Tanks. So there's a variety of ones that I'm not I'm looking for. So I'll give the chat a chance to vote on that next time. Mm -hmm. But there's no more shows for... No more extra shows. It's gonna. It's scheduled for the next shows. For the next few. Uh, because the next episode is John Champo's Developer Spotlight. <gasps> Ooh. That's a very exciting one. Yep. So we're going to run through his whole list of games, all the way back to his DOS days. That's Oh, really? Yes. And wow. we actually have some exclusive DOS games. Wow, really? As well. Wow. Um, and Gorf Arcade. Exclusive premiere of Gorf that's Arcade. That's really Next cool. episode. Yeah, so it's a huge really cool. show. Yeah. Um, you need then you need virtual patches mm. in the plus. That means I have to do them all over again with the plus card in my. Oh, that's true. <laughs> no. no, maybe I, what I should do is do it with the plus card. Yeah. So that I can have it registered. Yeah. Maybe the next one, because then yeah. I can show off that feature. Yeah. Actually, I should yeah. have done that today. Well, Stupid. it's okay. You were using your original cart, but, which is kind of. But fun this to game do may too. not be on the plus card so you have to only, not all of them are not yeah. all of them are because yeah. they have to be altered yep true true um uh, so yeah developer spotlight you do not want to miss that yes um i will let everybody know again in the atari age forums because it was bumped before mm. um i'll make a separate thread for that um somewhere in the homebrew thing i think it's important enough people would want to know yeah um, and then we have the Holiday Homebrew Special. Yay! I We're cannot wait for that. A bunch of new Christmas games that we yeah. haven't played before. And uh, yeah, and even some exclusive Christmas games Ooh. that I haven't even put on there yet. That's exciting. Um, Cyberpunk 2077 for the Atari 26. That's it. Yes. <laughs> Will we put ray tracing on or not? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yes. No. 
I saw the early mock-up for Gorf Arcade more than a year ago, and it was amazing. Can't wait to see it now. Yeah. Oh, I was supposed to popped up. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Out of nowhere. Yeah, he's got some screenshots posted of Gorf Arcade, and it mm. does look really, really nice. Mm. Um, I haven't played it yet, because he's probably like, uh, <laughs> I've got a week left. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Um, no, he had it mostly done. He was heroes on plus card. Yeah. So I can do hero. Yeah. 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 Um, and there are special unannou unannounced events. I don't know if we'll get them before the end of the year. Mm. One is almost certain not to be at the end of the year now. Yeah. Uh, the other one, don't know. It's whenever it's ready, really. It's, yeah. It can be pushed in the new year. I'm yeah. fine. Yeah. Yeah. Santa Hero, I did uh, see that. I'm not going to play... I usually don't play hacks because they're the same game as the original game. Yeah, I mean, if it's cute. If it's cute enough and it's like, okay, that's yeah. Christmas-themed. I mean... If, I have played if, them. I was going to say, if we do a Christmas Day episode, which we're considering... Oh, we're doing Santa Jump, which is Amoeba Jump. Yeah. And it's Santa, so we're doing a, yeah. a hack. But, I mean, if we Sorry. do a Christmas Day one, we could do just all the silly hacks. That, that is a Christmas Day. Yeah. That, oh, is it? Yeah. Is that when we're doing the... Yeah, oh, okay. Christmas I didn't day. realize that was Christmas Day. Excellent. So we'll probably be doing that at noon. So Eastern... I think it is at noon. Oh, yeah. it's not. We should put it at noon instead of six, because we've got dinners and oh, stuff. Oh, yeah. I I mean, we're, we'll are we we'll be having a Busy. Zoom Christmas dinner or something with family. So. so we'll open our presents and then play. I Yeah. Right? We'll open our presents. Yeah. In the morning. Yeah. And then come play games for a bit. And then I can... Then make, have the dinner. Then make dinner, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That sounds like a plan. Yep. For those of you who have a few minutes in your Christmas day and want to mm. watch a little bit of uh, That'll be the afternoon video for gaming. East. That'll be the afternoon for East Coast. That'll yeah. be 3 it'll be It'll be the prep for dinner kind yeah. of time of the day. And so then... if you're not the one making yeah. dinner, <laughs> or yeah. you can have it running while you're making dinner. Put it on a tablet. Nothing wrong with that. Yeah. I do that all the time, actually. Yeah, you watch things? I watch things on my tablet while yeah. I'm making dinner. Often food-related things, but yeah. that's okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So we accomplished things today. It so. will be a fun Christmas. Yeah. Yeah, and we totally recognize that people aren't out and about and doing the things they used to. Yeah. So if you feel like joining us, then please do. And if you can't join us, we're okay with that, too, because it's... Uh, yeah, you can watch it later. Yeah. If you're... Uh, busy. Yeah. Busy. With family. It happens. Family that's in your own say, house. Yeah. <laughs> Watching mass, but that's the night before anyway, so that doesn't really yeah. matter. Yeah. Or, you know, zooming with other family. Yeah. Yeah. That's, zooming around. We'll be doing that too, so. Yeah. Uh, one second. Let me turn off the poll question. Oh, yeah. So what did the poll uh, come out to? Oh, you zookeeper. Didn't... No, but like, like, what were the percentages? Um, what did we end up with? They're all very dark now. No. <laughs> yeah. Two point eight for all of them. Okay. I mean, it's a lot of money to buy all of them. Oh yeah. And not everybody likes every genre. Yeah. Um, oh, it's so small. Avalanche five, Cannonhead Clash two, mm -hmm. Daredevil five, Deepstone Catacomb two. That needs to be higher. You yeah. You don't know what you're missing. Yeah. Awesome little uh, fun action RPG. Uh, Hugo Hunt. Nobody, nobody's buying Hugo Hunt right now. <laughs> nobody's buying, buying Miss Galactopus. It oh. is an older title. It is an older title, yeah. Um, so some people have it, or they've played it a lot. Ninja Sky in Low Res World, 13%. Very good. Panic Rooms 2, not a lot of people know about that because they haven't... It's uh, yeah. nobody. Nobody's seen it, tested it. Yeah, and I think they just released footage of it to sell it on Atari Age. Oh, wow. So a lot of people don't know about it because okay. I haven't played it on the show. No. Um, not that I'm saying that the show yeah, no, <laughs> drives but I know what sales you're saying. Yeah. exclusively, but, uh, I do know what you're saying. Uh, Pit Cat 5%, which is not an actual cartridge, but they're selling the box oh, and the manual good. and yeah. you can download the game for free. Oh, I see. And you might be able to get Al to make the game for you on cartridge, but, but I'm not certain probably? of it. No, no, it does it for 25, oh, I think. Oh, that's not yep. bad. Plus shipping. Yeah. Uh, Robot City, 13, awesome 4K game. Mm -hmm. uh, the End, 5%. Tower of Rubble, 13. Uh, Venture Reloaded, 8. And Zookeeper, 16. So it's Zookeeper. very spread out. Yeah. A lot like, of people like a lot, a lot of, games. of games. Yeah. Yeah. And there's so That's many cool. different genres there. Very nice. 
So thanks everybody yes. for tuning in. Uh, I, and I've noticed there's there was like a waves. rapid change <laughs> in the people showing up at the beginning versus the end. So oh, a lot yeah. of people couldn't make it at the beginning, That's possibly, true. and showed up later. S. Ooh, Ramirez was steady. saying he was watching three episodes of The Queen's Gambit with his wife, which mm. is, a, is a series everyone keeps mentioning, and I feel like I need to watch because everyone keeps mentioning it to me. So yeah, but Darcy said that uh, Darcy really liked it. Well, no, he said that the chess board sold really well. Oh, yeah, because Darcy works at a board game store. Oh, owns a board game yeah. store. Yeah. Um, or, yeah, owns, well, sorry, yeah. <laughs> Not just works, but actually owns a board game store. And I saw in, in the Vancouver. news that chess sales are up 33% or, really? three, or 300% percent or something that's crazy really like funny. that. That's really funny. So, yeah, that's doing really well. Prow said he was playing Zookeeper earlier, the arcade version. Nice. On an arcade machine. <gasps> That'd be nice. I've never seen an mm -hmm. arcade machine of Zookeeper. But we, we also have Zookeeper arcade version on PS2 or... PS2, uh, I think. Yeah. PS2. Main. Oh, that's even better. I thought it was an Xbox, but maybe it was PS. Yeah, one of those. One of those retro compilations. Yeah, retro compilations, yeah. That's how I had my nice. Space Game 2K made. Oh, you got a 2K mm. version. Very cool made. Because mm -hmm. the 4K was put out on cartridge, but the 2K wasn't. It's pretty good. Mm. The space game is pretty good. We played it last episode, but the 4K version of it. Mm. Yeah. Um, thanks for tuning in, everyone. I was S. Ramirez, 2008, Prow 7, Metal Lunar 7. Mm -hmm. Prow 7 posted? and Metal Lunar 7. Yeah, lots of stuff. Uh, Ice Bosta, yeah. Captain Classic. Dunkist. Um, Dunkist, yeah. Uh, Azure six five zero two, Danny VC yes, Cafe Man two D, Flackets, Packrat VG, Nutty O three nice. Is that a new name? No, 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 no. Nutty's been here. Before. Miss Command. Excellent. We'll be doing some more uh, um, play testing, beta testing, mm. penalt this weekend probably. Mm. Crossbow seven seven seven. VHZC, thank you so much yes, for making your game. for dropping in. For your new game yes. on the 7800. Now that I can add awesome. it to the list. Mm -hmm. You're on uh, the uh, uh, um, works in progress list now. Oh, nice. That. I'll have to add that. Excellent. Uh, what else? We've free got TV free 12. Yes. Thank you for making um, your fun card game. Very, very fun. Very oh. simple, very fun. Yeah. yeah. We should go through those. Um, yeah, we played Iran. Uh, which didn't change much. I think there's like one new thing, but it's an awesome game. And then we played the board game, which I can't remember the name. It's very mm -hmm. long, which was a very good start. Um, lots of fun. I can see that ending up being really good once the game balancing mm -hmm. is in there. And we played Cribbage uh, Squares. Is that it? Cribbage Squares. That's really fun. More fun than I expected. But but simple card games are often the mm -hmm. funnest. Solitaire yeah. fun. There, I I uh, really enjoy that. Yeah, that's the kind of game that could be on your desktop and you would just play it for oh, hours. Yeah. You know, it's yep. it's really nice. It's really well uh, thought out. Yeah, really uh, fun game. Uh, UFO, red, redder. Yeah, UFO redder. Uh, weird. I'm letting the cat. Yeah, you can come in now. No. I've accomplished my goal. Um. You can come in now. Uh, in caved, not my type of game, but uh, <laughs> executed just fine. Yeah. <laughs> and pressure cooker, uh, incredible game. Yeah. Hard as hell. I barely got it. And night guy on board because that was the oh, pop up game that that uh, yes. you, we decided to uh, give night it a try. Night guy on board, great name too. Yeah. Um, Naughty Cat was locked out. Yes, he was licking and He was interfering and while he was trying to uh, get his high score. So It was more about the distraction of yeah. him being there. He than... was licking his hand as he was playing, which is not the greatest for going yeah. for a high score. So. Nostalgic 26. Oh, yes. now he's chewing cables. Yeah, bad cat. What are you doing? Come and be a cute cat. Come here. Arena Foot. Yeah. Nostalgic 26. Oh. Metal Atari 1969. Uh, and that's the end of it. I think so. Yeah, excellent. Glad for all the people who stuck X around. X yeah. Good morning. What, what did I, I miss? <laughs> Everything. Everything. So you have to rewind. Yeah. Or wait till tomorrow. Yeah. And you can watch it then. Mm -hmm. Uh, so we're done here. Yes. Thanks for watching. We'll be back next Friday with a huge show. John Champo, Champ Games, yes. Spotlight, running the full gambit of all of his games. 
Come on. I think a small plus catnip joystick would give them something else to chew rather than cables. <laughs> yeah, we'll make a catnip joystick. Yeah. Wouldn't that be cute? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there he's we happy. Go. Happy kitty. Yeah, he's Good come cat. to celebrate my win. Yes. Hi. Hi. Okay, that's it. We're done. That's it right for here. Us. Have a good night. Thank you for, Have a good for weekend. swinging by. And yep. it was a long show today, but it, it accomplished what we wanted. Yes. <laughs> yes. And you really didn't think uh, you would do it either. No, not at all. Which is which is really um, really nice. And it I'm is. glad you stuck around to to try the last couple of, of, oh of turns. So, Goodness, yeah. 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 And, okay. See you next bye. Friday. Definitely be there. John Shampoo, Champ yes. Game, Spotlight. Yeah. Okay. Bye-bye, everyone. Bye.